expect me in here. <laughs> Nobody's gonna expect me in here. <laughs> what the expect? I saw you run in there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, k -k 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 Strike me as a loser. I mean, loner. You're a loner. Excuse me? Uh, uh, don't you look away from me? I'm not talking to you. Are you like that? Guess we have to press it, right? No, I'm gonna press it. I don't need you. That was disappointing. Call me a loose for right shit. Why don't you try it? See? Puppet I can't do shit. Nudy do, I'm a puppet. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Only you could press a button wrong, host. Really hammer it. I don't want to. Well, whatever. I guess it doesn't work. Like stuff that doesn't need to do shit. <laughs> oh! Oh, shit. That's Owen. That's the guy who made us. And then. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> come on, come on! Someone in the in, come on! We, we need a ball. We don't have a ball, but whatever. Imagine, imagine, imagine you have a ball here, right? Dance! Come on, come on, dance! Now, go for it. Dad, Dad. <laughs> come on, dance for me! <laughs> come on! <laughs> So this is, this is what it's bubbled for. Let <laughs> 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 it twerk in the background here. Twerky, twerky, twerky. <laughs> twerky, twerky, twerky. I've been, I've been practicing. Twerky, twerky, twerky. <laughs> bow chicken, bow wow, twerk. You got. <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone's pop shotting at me! Someone popped some shots. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! No! You doing the Is YMCA? You doing the YMCA? YMCA. Uh, <laughs> That's my oh. personal domicile! Nice. <laughs> I shaved your life. Let's be friends, please. please. You shaved Let's his be life. Friends. Please. Let's be friends. Yes, friends. Friends. Now where's his knife? <laughs> the letters are broken. Give me your knife. Give me your knife. You, just, you said you shaved Give his life. Give me your knife. knife. Give me your knife. Yes, sure. Yes, sure. Yes, sure. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> you think I'm playing? I'll be there. Were you dreaming? I'll be there. You think I'm playing? You've been taking a shower. I'll be there. Think I'm playing? <laughs> when you're making sweet love to your girlfriend, think I'm playing? I'll be there. <laughs> we spawn southeast. He's gonna have to, so we're gonna have to go back. Yeah. I was gonna say, just give me some latitudes and I'll work my way. If you two already oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Like, Shit, no shit. I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> oh. Bye, cross. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this big fucker. <laughs> That motherfucker come out of nowhere. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I'm running away. Oh. <laughs> Mama. Hank, in my office. Now, schnell. I can explore while you're doing stuff. Uh, I wanted to talk to the donuts. In the goop! In the goop! In the goop! <laughs> in the goop! <laughs> That's the wrong guy in the goop! 
what's the um music video? Whoop de goop de boop de goop. Wait, we can't, we can't, we can't, we can't. Don't leave me! Don't leave me! No, 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 no. 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 No, in the <laughs> dick! <laughs> <laughs>Thank you so very much for the uh, the little subscription, Diva. That's 22 freaking months. That's a long ass time to be subscribed to anybody. You know that? It's a long ass time. Um, also, that reminds me that we are coming up to my two years soon. That's going to be crazy. Two years of streaming. That means you have been streaming for five years, I think, Diva. <laughs> Jesus. Um, today, we're playing something a little bit different. Um, I wanted to have something... Uh, a little bit like more chillax, relax, just do it. And I've been watching um, this when it came out, and I saw it on um, a game expo. It's called Little Witch in the Woods. And the first thing I thought is, this reminds me very much of my art style when it came to the pixel game I was working on uh, before Christmas. And I thought, this is, this, this is crazy. This is exactly what I envisioned. Just cuter. This is like a cuter mob version of what I was thinking when I was uh, working on my own stuff. But uh, what I really want to realize or really want to know is, is it close to like Stardew Valley in some sense? I actually just want a game I can just hang out in right now. I just want something that it's not super hardcore. It's not like in your face all the time, super scary, super action filled. I want to relax, hang out, and pick mushrooms and make spells. So today, we are playing The Little Witch in the Woods. Um, so, so, so far, I only know that it's a super, uh, super chill game. It's very cute. It's very uh, relaxed, I guess. That's exactly what I wanted. Other than that, I don't... Other than that, I don't really know too much about it, so we'll have to find out. So let's just jump in. I'm starting a new game. I haven't set up settings or nothing as usual. Choo choo! So let's see what this is about. Look at that cute little thing. Looks so derpy. So this is a pixel game. Um, I wonder where Carrot was. So this is Ellie. This is the main character. You still thinking about that? Says the hat. We found everything except the carrot, says Ellie. I think it's good that we have never found a carrot. There was something off about that legendary carrot soup recipe. I just realized we never checked the men's restroom. Uh, I can't go there. I'm a girl. I'm a... <laughs> there is, yes, there is some lines you don't cross, indeed. We searched a whole school, save for that place. Uh, but we never found the carrots. That means the carrots in the men's restroom. A carrot in the men's restroom. What an odd sense of humor. <laughs> I should write uh, Jenny a letter asking her to look through the men's room. Can you ask Will instead? It's a men's room after all. Thank you for the lurk, Diva. Catch you in a bit. Nope, that coward finds it. If that coward finds it, he'll take it to the teacher, bawling, like before. Keep in mind that it weren't, if it weren't for Will, you'd be in jail right now. <laughs> what did we do? <laughs> or six feet under. Ugh, I'm so bored. It's a, it's a flashback. <laughs> Flashbacks are supposed to be boring. I see why no one else wants to ride this god-awful train. It's bo uh, boring enough to drive anyone insane. Hey, a ticket for this train costs 500 pies. Are we paying them in pies? That's a lot of pies. And uh, it's and it stop the witch house in Highland, High Lion, where all roads lead to. 
You're second place at the school for witches. <laughs> Whatever. I don't care about all, any of that. How am I second place anyway? I even sneaked into the forbidden room twice. Three times. I even looked through the forbidden books in the hidden library in the, in the school basement. I still remember that <laughs> horned rabbit that was uh, as big as a house. No wonder Will stayed, started crying. So how did I manage second place? I simply don't want to lose. Cut it out and sit quietly. This train is only for those who want to succeed. The witch house might be dark and damp, but it's only three years of your life. Fine, fine. Enough of, with the lecture. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm disturbed. <laughs> I'm disturbed with the thought of taking off my shoes when I get off the train. Shoes? For what? I wonder what kind of trouble you'll get into when we arrive. I won't. I won't fool around the moment I get there. I didn't know you <laughs> had self-awareness. Don't you know about the terrible city of rules? That's High Lion. The first thing I do is to take my. The first thing you do is to take your shoes off as soon as you get off the train. This is my first time hearing something like that. I heard that Jenny's old sister was wearing strappy boots when she first arrived at High Lion. Let me guess, this is just like a prank someone was pulling off on her. I like the drawing though. The the, the it's very pretty. And that's um, that's a little bartender lion, or is that a cheetah? It's plump, that's what it is. Maybe it's food. I know above that it's like a, um, a Vincent Van Gogh pa painting. So she, uh, so she almost couldn't get off because she had to unstrap them completely. See? Mom bought new shoes as well. Didn't Arya just mean to encourage you? No, Dad also said that comfortable boots would be better. That's strange. It's true. I'll also ask other uh, other people if you don't believe me. Keyword gained. Lace up boots. It's a pain to wear lace up boots if you're uh, boarding the a train to High Lion. Am I not walking around? The I am walking around. This is amazing. The food was really delicious, though. Your face was bright only when um, only when you were eating after <laughs> getting on the train. The omelette was so overflowing with cheese and crab meat as soon as it was cut. Crab meat omelette. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. The pink salmon steak seasoned with fresh lemon scented kiwi sauce. See your eyes sparkling. Even a slightly frozen strawberry peach and peach sorbet with whipped cream. Without this meal, I would have jumped off the train sooner. It's definitely different from what, uh, the food you buy at the store, at the, uh, for, at the school for witches. I ate, uh, had, <laughs> I ate that to collect the great, um, I ate that to collect the great witch series cards. I got scolded because I was caught keeping the card and throwing away the bread. Don't do that again in High Lion. I'll definitely try the uh, Nubicula cupcake there. Nubicula. That's if we get to highlight before I get bored to death. So... Left trigger is keywords. So we can talk to three people. Um, we need to be, make sure that the, the, tr the truth is the truth. R? That's a quest. Why is inventory Hello Mr. Bartender Hey, wanna drink? No, I don't drink alcohol. Do you have any tea? Of course. Then I have a cup of that. Let's actually move my, my head up a little bit so we can see these. Mm. Now all the cuties are here. Um Tea has alcohol though. Is that okay? But then that's just alcohol. Alcohol with tea. 
potato potato <laughs> they can ask you a question instead of a drink anytime uh, okay so that's key where you can change the category something on your mind chit chat let me know if you need anything uh, to drink want some water um, what sort of work do you do here? I'm mixing my life uh, and changing the alcohol. <laughs> I'm mixing my life and changing the alcohol. Instead of mixing the alcohol and changing my life. Wait, I think it's the other way around. I'm just an average bartender working in the most expensive place in the world. What brings you to this very expensive train? I thought you were listening to our conversation. I stopped listening when uh, I, it got boring. <laughs> I'm going to be an apprentice at the witch house in High Lion. After working as an apprentice for three years, I will, I will be able to graduate from the school for witches. Wow, High Lion, huh? That's a right proper place, isn't it? So, that's so they say. That's probably why uh, you got to, uh, the train ticket for free. You must be someone special. I don't really care about that kind of thing, though. That kind of thing? Is that... Uh, is... Uh, is That kind of thing is what's important at the end of the day. Just, uh, best of... Uh, best to just suck it up. Uh, you'll be glad you did later down the road, you know? Yeah, later. What's up? Go with a lace up boots. Can I take a look at your shoes? And my shoes? What for? For what I've heard, you have to take your shoes off before uh, stepping foot into the High Line station. You worked at the train, so uh, uh, you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, that story. Absolutely, plenty of confused passengers who were uh, all dressed up for High Line. If you're wearing shoes of that sort, I'd advise you to untie them in advance. <laughs> oh, yeah? Uh, who... Uh, O ye who reacheth high line, look first upon thy shoes. Or so that's how the saying goes. See, Virgil, I was right. The, uh, the preppy boots mom gave me as a present is just too much. Those are some nice boots. <laughs> right? My mom bought them for me when she found out I was graduating uh, magna cum laude. It's sure amazing you're graduating magna cum laude. Um, despite your antics. Are you gonna keep up with that attitude of yours? <laughs> Hearing the two of you speak, I have a feeling being bored won't be an issue. <laughs> nope, it's so boring. Aren't you bored, Mr. Bartender? I've gotten used to it. But it's uh, certainly gotten less boring thanks to you and your hat. You've been listening? <laughs> Other guests would have heard about your arson at the... <laughs> Other guests would have heard about your arson at the school for witches by now. I didn't set it on fire. Really? Uh, sure, there was a fire, but uh, that was because I shook a potion five times and made it explode. Potion must be shaken three times only. Even a nun witch like me knows that. That might be something we need to know in the future. Exactly. How can he not try shaking it four times having heard that? <laughs> but you said you shook it five times. Nothing happened on the fourth time, so I shook it once more. <laughs> An inquisitive mind you got there. <laughs> you got the making of a fine witch. Thanks for the praise. Uh, thanks for the praise. I don't think he was praising you. <laughs> I should be on my way then. All right, have a fun trip. I can't act like a country bumpkin once you're in the city. Got it? You're not going to ask just one person, are you? Why? One is never enough, you know. Even the greatest detective never reach a conclusion based on a single piece of evidence. Hmm, you have a point. So we have passengers as well. The animations are cute, I like that. Ordinary passenger. Hello. Oh, hello. 
Am I disturbing you? Uh, negative. That's, uh, what's the issue? I want to ask you about something. You're on the way to Highline, right? Correct. Um, what's the matter? Oh, it's just that you have a very blunt way of speaking. Oh my, old habit dies hard, especially when one is deep in thought. You sound like a janitor from my school. Well, I used to be a soldier. So what brings you here? Speak. Since I'm not much of a talker, I don't have anything to say about in particular. Speak. You live in Highline? Correct. I own a flower shop there. Wow. Speak. <laughs> I do run a flower shop, but you can see I'm just a normal passenger at the moment. Speak. <laughs> Speak. Before that. Before what? You've been star uh, staring at my feet for a while. Is there something kind of uh, some kind of problem? Oh, I was just going to ask anyway. Uh, isn't it uncomfortable to wear such a strappy boots? It takes some time to put them on and uh, take them off, uh, but I'm used to it. Then it would uh, be hard for you to arrive at High Lion. What? What are you talking about? I mean, you have to take your shoes off when you get get off. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? Oh, you were kidding. I'm sorry, I'm rather dull when it comes to things like this. Jenny! Mr. Bartender! Mm. <laughs> the mystery has been solved. Did I make some kind of mistake? No, no, I just realized that I was uh, deceived. Come to think of it, I remember now. It's a joke to make fun of people who visit Thailand for the first time. Stop, you don't have to kill me twice by giving me that much detail. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you holding back laughter? Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> Look at him, he's so, he's so flushed. He's trying so hard to be considerate of you. Uh, don't ask quite, twice. Virgil, I hate to be even... hate you even more now. Uh, you don't need to be so upset. Uh, when I went there the first time in the past, I was also tricked by a colleague and took them off. That doesn't comfort me at all. I'm sorry. Uh... How do you feel? Why are you asking me that? Your morals might uh, fall out, or mol molars might fall, fall out, so relax a bit and tell me. I can't believe Jenny deceived me. There's a reason why she is your friend. Now go back to your seat quietly and wait until you've, you've arrived. We still have three more days to go. Three more days, that's terrible, that's the smell of uh, potted shit. Uh, shit. <laughs> That's as terrible as the smell of uh, spotted shiitake mushrooms. Are shiitake mushrooms that smelly? I don't think I've actually smelled any raw ones before. Let's talk to the, um, the otter. Train crew. Up the train is the engine room. I'm attendant of the uh, Brightman's Railroad. My job is to ensure the passengers comfort and safety. Up ahead is the engine room. Small talk is forbidden during operation. Up ahead is the engine room. Please save any inquiries regarding the souvenirs at the station until after we exit the train. Up ahead is the engine room. I guess up ahead is the engine room. Sure, speak. Goodbye then. That's interesting. So we talk to the bartender again and see if we can. Uh... Welcome. Something on your mind? I only sell alcohol for the moment. What's up? Uh... They don't think we can uh, catch him out on this. All right, now we have some patience to stay seated. Ugh. The truth remains. I'm bored. <laughs> but you just sat down. This is torture. Stare out to the window if you're so bored. Yeah, look outside. 
Look at that mountain. It must be hiding a cave with strange pillar statues, giants and a giant door. Sound like a prologue to a story where you have awakened a terrible demon. Wait, hold on Virgil. Shut up and look out the window. It's something up the mountain. There's a gigantic shining tree on the top. A gigantic shining tree? Why is it shining? Does it have luminous flowers? It must be beautiful up close. Give it up. This train won't stop for two days. Ugh, I want to get out now. I hope we crash. Fat chance of that happening. So just stay bored. After all, you signed up for three three years even of even more boredom. Aren't there any um, crocophants? Why does crocophants sound so familiar to me? Like I I feel like I've read about crocophants before. It's like a, a children's story or something. Nope. How about boa constrictors? Uh, this isn't the jungle. Train robbers? This isn't the Wild West, it's a healing game. Remember? Healing game? Hey, b a boa constrictor! The correct line is, what's going on? <laughs> there's no station here, why are we stopping? I'm not sure, maybe there's something wrong with the engine? I'll train, I guess. I doubt the, I doubt it's a boa constrictor though. I don't care if it's um, if it's a I don't care if it's not a boa constrictor. Please just say there's some massively critical issue. Please, 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 please. We apologize for the inconvenience. A critical issue, perhaps? The train cannot continue its journey due to critical issue. Yes. Attention, there is tr the train will stop until tomorrow morning, and the departure time. Can we go outside? Will likely be announced tomorrow. We'll, we'll be depart immediately. <laughs> we will depart immediately if possible. Okay, I'll be back in a bit. In the meantime, please avoid wandering too far from the train. Let's go. I'm not sure if you remember, uh, but of course I remember. The shining tree is at the peak. No, not that. We have to get back by tomorrow morning. Then we should get going. Are we gonna get lost? Oh, it's so dark. If you're scared, uh, we can go back into the train. I love it. Let's hurry. Going for the shining tree, I guess. Sorry, you can't go beyond here. Why did the train stop? There's something in the train's path. They're working on getting rid of whatever it is in the way. Something's in our way? Is it a boa constrictor? A boa constrictor? No, no, no. It's a strange uh, prickly wine. A strange prickly wine. Yeah, prickly wine. It wasn't there yesterday, but it seemed to have grown overnight. We can't uh, seem to cut it down with a regular axe, but we're doing our best. Uh, we've contacted the witches, so I'm sure they'll be here to help in no time. I can take a, can I take a look? I happen to be a witch. You're a, you're a passenger. Our responsibility to make sure you're safe. We'll take care of it, so please be patient. Can I just take a peek? I'm sorry. Ah, poor 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 girl can't even look at the the thingy. Another question is, what is around here? And our task is to... Oh, it's saved. I thought it crashed for a second. So I guess our task is to find a way to get to the... Um, the fluorescent tree. Huh? That's no weed. What's that? I left something behind? A rittering. A rittering? That's a cute name. Why was it buried in there? Someone could have buried it. Or it could have been sleeping. You're gonna have to be more specific than that. There's not much that's known about the Ritterings. Well, other than uh, good fortune if you find one. Yeah, I guess it did leave behind a gift of sorts. Uh, try to spot them while you're wandering around. Okay, well, I will look for more. 
I just wandered around saw like a uh, an arrow. It's a hill. It won't be easy to climb. <laughs> Look over there, there's some vines hanging on the hill. I'll be able to climb that much. That's bad news. Crunch, crunch. It's a secret passageway, uh, uh, where, Virgil. I don't think it's a secret passageway. I bet there's a path beyond there. Now we know there's like hidden stuff around. What's this? Looks like little honey pumpkin. What's that? A type of weed that grows in the forest, uh, for in forested areas. The vine grows so fast that you can never get rid of, uh, rid of it by a hand. You must find a nucleus hidden somewhere to get rid of it. Then I guess I can also get rid of this um, if we find a nucleus. Uh, or just return to the train quietly. That can't happen. Let's go look for the nucleus. It must be nearby. Uh, since the nucleus gives off a light um, when you touch the wine, you'll be able to find it. So I guess the nucleus is the thing that's in front of the train? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hi, Karines. How are you doing? Great, it's time to explore. Please don't use that word, explore. That word gives me the anxiety. No thanks to your mother. Oh, we can sprint now. I am speed. Fast. Gotta get fast. What's that? Cran apple? A branch, another branch. How are you doing, Karinas? Having a good time? A witch flower. Let me know if you you need me to turn down the volume or something. Suddenly got a lot. Uh... Uh, so we have curse lifting candy and a weed terminator. Everything else is blurred out. Plenty of time to return afterwards, uh, but have a lovely stream. Thank you, Shia. This is a game I think you would love, Shia, by the way. Doing quite well. Um, got back a little while ago gathering apricots. Ooh. Did you catch many? I need to come from the other side to do that, I guess. Oh, it's a well here. Well, 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 what do we have here? Nothing I can do with it. That's all like I could like pull the handle um, If you have the game pass, it's free. I Don't know how much it is though on Steam It's on Xbox. I'm playing it on Xbox currently But it was on the it was on game pass. I Don't know if it's on the the, the PC version of game pass though. That's the question but um, Definitely nice so about 13 pounds on Steam. Not that much actually, it's quite quite nice. 
So what I know about it, what I've seen people do so far, is that um, at some point you will get a little cabin you live in, and um, you start collecting um, recipes and gathering stuff to create different potions and witch spells and crafts that you will sell in the town. That's so far I remember uh, seeing of, from it. It also looks very much like the game I was trying to make it, uh, a while ago. I don't have the right shock, so that might be a spell. I can't imagine Shy the Witch. And we have to go bedtime. Uh, talk to you later. Enjoy your bedtime. can't go that way. Can I go up? A mountain? That's a bad thing, right? Always hated mountains. My uh, leather gets worn out from the, all the wind. I don't have anything to catch them with. I want to catch the butterflies. The butterflies. Bu Maple herb, dangle mango, so cute. It's like there's something in here. I need to get like something to catch these things with. Hi everybody, how are you guys doing? We are playing the most adorable little game right now. How are you doing? How was... Um, is it Destiny you're playing now? Is it uh, uh, Divinity or whatever it's called? Destiny 2, yeah. That's free to play now, isn't it? It used to cost a lot of money. Okay, I don't have any shock for this. I don't know if I can get up here, can I? No, I have this cloud in the way. No, I can. <gasps> Hello? What's this? It's a flower. Um... Welcome Zerglings. Um, went well till the end. I saw that you, uh, you end up dying to something, a uh, boss fight or something, uh, right before I started streaming. I've been wanting to play this for a while, so um, I'm looking forward to it. I still don't really know what's it about, but it's very, very pretty. I'm collecting all sorts of things, too. It's meant to be a team of three and I made it to the boss, couldn't do it. Oh, you were, you were by yourself? Because I miss being able to play legacy content. Can't do it, but just my hands, I guess. Gonna have food, enjoy your lurk, enjoy your food. What are you gonna eat? Anything nice?
Why are there so many things blocking the path? It must be the forest with many secrets. Chicken something. Mmm, chimkin. Uh, what's this? Looks like a berry made with witch pattern. Witch pattern? Um, is there a witch here? Uh, there was, or do you know how it works? School hammered into my head. Shouldn't be an issue as long as it, as long as it's drawn well. I guess I have to wait until. Uh, I think here you need to have a growth spell or something. This is blocked off as well. Swing. We found it. Now what's around here? Also, oh, so it was, it was, it was um, illuminescent with butterflies. Butterflies. Wow, it's a gigantic shining tree. It's the same one we saw from the train. This is a bitter grape tree tree. Tea tree. Bitter grape tea tree. I don't think uh, the tree... I don't think the tree is... Um, I don't think... Oh, I don't think it's a tree that is shining. Check it out, Virgil. There's, there are tons of butterflies on it. You're right. The butterflies seem to be glowing. Uh, these are blue moon butterflies. It's a Deku tree. Uh, you mean, is it not a Deku tree? I thought it was a Deku tree. It's a Count Dooku tree. <laughs> Unlimited butterflies. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The butterfly gives off a subtle moonlight. The light from these butterflies has the same power as the actual moonlight. That's why strange things always happen around these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? A giant tea tree with butterflies glowing in the moonlight. It's not just beautiful, it's ex extremely fascinating sight to behold. Isn't this just a pretty magnificent discovery? Did you know that those two are rare creatures? So what's it, what's about it? The fact that these two are together is is amazing. Uh, what about those t uh, two being together? They're usually raised together artificially to get moonflower on um, look look lucerine or two. It's weird names coming in there. It's uncommon for them to be together or naturally like this. Mm, anyway, did we find something? We did find something, right? I guess so. I'll have to write a letter to the school later. Let's look around a bit more. Fill up the codex and all, right? It's don't be late. We must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Okay. Let's go back to the way we came up. There might be other strange things. Well, we don't have chalk, do we? I don't think I'll get a wink of sleep on the train. I wonder if there's uh, anywhere I can sleep for the, th for the night. What about the ground? The dirt looks... <laughs> The dirt and rocks look like a nice bed. That's not funny, Virgil. Look, a blue moon butterfly. We saw the peak here, too. You must uh, as well collect them for study purposes. Now I can collect the butterflies. Do you remember what uh, Dr. Graves said? You sneak up and collect them. Death lives under the bed. No, not that. Draw it before you touch it. That's right. Let's go and draw it. Ta -da -da -da. Blue Moon Bubblefly. I need a net to collect it. And that's what you get from it. A butterfly emits off blue light. It's registered in the catalog. Let's see. Oh, cute glasses. Now do you see how you can catch them right now, right? Um, you see why you can't catch them right now? Um, tool? Hmm, so you can't collect 
than me using a butterfly net. I don't have one right now. Not much you can do now then. But I want to do it right now. <laughs> Getting the witch house in Highline is more important. And um, let's go back down there. Uh, there's got to be something else that's fun. I wonder if there's anything to do with that uh, that thing we saw up here. Okay, so we have two things we can use. I guess this thing will repair the bridge if you had some shock. If we only had some shock. Oh, hello. I guess we need a tool to do use this. I don't reckon this little witch will be carrying a pickaxe in the future, but maybe. got that too. A bush bug. I uh, need a net for that as well. Now we miss a uh, little mandrake. Have we found a mandrake yet? I don't think we have actually found a mandrake. Oh wow! Look at that cat. Uh, Ellen, let's go back to the train. Look at that, Virgil! It's a shining white cat! I've never seen anything like that before. Ellie, you have to... Let's go after that creature! Kitty cat, kitty cat. That's a ghost cat right there. Uh, Star Silver Bell. Then we got these two, I guess. I think the cat dropped something. What, what's this? It looks like a witch shark. I think you can draw things like a pattern. It looks like a little different from the ones we ha uh, are using at school. It's just as different as pa it's just a different packaging. Seems to erase a little bit. Um, it won't work if you get to erase a little bit. You can draw the pattern using the same colored witch shark. Uh, since I have the just, it's, if I have one, I just picked up earlier. Let's draw it that again. Uh, I should draw the pattern again using um, one witch shark. I guess so. It says there's a potion uh, shop this way. All right, I drew the witch pattern again. I guess I could have used this anywhere, but... Um, do I have more of it? Oh, this is a cute house, isn't it? Huh? Where did the cat go? Look, Virgil, there's a house. Uh, that's a witch house, isn't it? It looks pretty old. I guess we can take the talk to the master witch here and stay here for a while. It doesn't look like there's any people inside. If there is no one, uh, I might stay for a while. Isn't it natural for an apprentice witch to be at the witch house? That's true, but breaking and entering, that's what we're doing right now. Breaking and entering. All we need to do in life. So you can take a nap there. Anyone there? 
there anyone there? Housekeeping? It seems like nobody's here. It could be abandoned witch house. Because the witch administration can't figure out everything. Alright, let's go inside. Oh. It really is... It really is abandoned witch house. Talking in that in, taking that into consideration, it looks okay. Um, although it's not that clean. The witch house is managed on her own. It doesn't seem to be um, a very good condition considering how dirty it is. Uh, but the bed looks fine. I guess I can just sleep here. Um, well, since the witch house is a public institution, it's okay to sleep in one night or so. And it's better than sleeping outside. Stamina. So we, we have a stamina meter. I want to clean up. I guess if I sleep here, I will wake up and the train is gone, right? Do I have any more shock I can use? I'll have to, I think there's a one around here somewhere I could use, I guess. Not this one. And was it one here? I know there's one up here somewhere which I can use. But I don't know if I have any shock left. I don't have the right shock. Yeah, I'm out of shock then. I guess the game really wants me to sleep. We could go back to the train and stay there, but... What's the fun in that, right? Okay, so, um, I guess there's no way other than just, uh, going to that bed. There's a well up here, by the way. I don't know if uh, we can do anything with that. The green forest plains. There's a well right there. I think you can sleep on that, um... Huh. Guess not. Not a bush bug. I want to sleep, not there we go, sleep. I'll oversleep, right? Um uh oh. What's with that face? You slept on the night nice fluffy bed. Yeah, but I dreamt that I was sleeping on the train. All that effort not to sleep on the train, only to dream just that? You should have just slept on the train. No, that's not it. I slept very well, actually. I can almost hear the sound of the train, though. Wait, it's not... It's not actually the train... The sound of the train? Hmm? Wait, wait. It's taking off already? Let's hurry. It really is the sound of the train. I think it's about to take off. Let's hurry back. I woke up just in time. I'm glad I didn't sleep in. The bunny's around. <laughs> Pudgy. Squish squash fur. We gotta miss the train, aren't we? Wait for little me, I have small teeny tiny legs. Huh? 
There is... Where's the train? Ah, oh, looks like that bird was imitating the train sounds. But where's the train? It probably went to High Lion. Uh, then what do we do now? Look around the area. I'm sure we'll find some clues. Why are you so calm? I've been through much worse uh, with your mom. So this is my mom sat, I guess. It's a letter here, most likely dedicated to us. And what's that? What is that thing? It's called a Gaga bird. <laughs> Lady Gaga bird. Uh, they say it's a bit insane. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Quiet, I don't want to hear it. It's your fault for oversleeping. Don't blame the Gaga bird. Fine, whatever. Just be quiet. A letter? How nice of them to leave a letter behind. Let's see. I think it's from the bartender, uh, bartender on the train. You're probably shocked to see the train is gone. Uh, a witch suddenly appeared in the middle of the night and got rid of the prickly wines. They said they can't wait because the train is was already delayed, so we had to leave. But don't worry, the train will come back at the... And there's a village nearby I, I used to live in. You can just spend uh, some time there, and then uh, there should be a sign in the forest. So take a look and look. Take a look and go find a village. Then, uh, when you arrive at the village, please send E Knight and Arden my regards. Bartender. He said there's a village, Virgil. Virgil. Are you even a little upset that we missed the train, Ellie? There's a village nearby. But I can't imagine where it would be. We explored it quite a lot yesterday. Uh, it was probably too dark to see. Let's look for it again. See if there was a sign as well. How about cleaning the witch house? We might have stay uh, have to stay there um, until we find a village. Okay. Please do uh, don't uh, please do not sound so excited. We missed the train. Remember? Uh, when the train comes back, we still need to pay them like five hundred uh, pies. You heard me right. Well, then, I might as well add more to the encyclopedia now. I guess. Can I just walk this way? Nah. It's stuck this way. So, we are the little witch in the wood after all. So, let's uh, skadoodle skedaddle. And squish some more bunnies. What was with those bunnies though? They were cute. Maybe we need to fix this at some point in order to find water. Where did all the bunny go? Also, that's what these are for. Squish. Squish. Squish, uh, squishy shove fur. That's what they're called? Squishy shubs? That's adorable. I can't get through here because I don't have the tools for it. Uh, I have no... I actually have some space left. Uh, and I don't think I can actually go that much more places. Because I have explored majority of the things around here. Uh, except from here. Well, of course you haven't explored here yet. It did say sh uh, check the, the house. Three more things to the catalog. Hmm. We have three more things we can add to it. It just says to acquire something here. A bird. <laughs> Got the burb.
We've already sorted that out, but we don't have any quill or nothing to, to deal with it. So we can get the dangle mango and the, uh, the maple herb. I don't think there's much more after that. It says we could have like three things to collect too. Unless there's something up here I haven't seen before. This seems, still seems like it's supposed to be something. I guess we can go back to the tree and draw the tree, right? Wait, no, I can't do that. Um, we need to make this grow first. Maybe with a watering can? It's good as uh, AAA games can be, sometimes you just uh, can't beat a pixel sprite in the game. That is true. That's so true. It's, I don't know what it is. It might be the nostalgia, maybe just the simpleness of it. The calmness of the cuteness, I guess. The calm before the cute. It's apparently two more things I can draw. Maybe some of that has to do with the stuff in my, um... In the house. Or is it something left behind, maybe? Because that's a well right there. The down sit tree again. <laughs> Do not underestimate the branch of my power. Not a bush bug. Oh, hello. So train is down there. Uh, it's a pond there, dark forest, house and village. The town lies east of here. I guess people do live around here. All right, let's head east. But it seems to be blocked by something over there. That's true, it's a little ho honey pumpkin. Let's go back and look first. Honey yummy yumkin. Uh, let's um, check the witch, for, uh, witch house a little bit, see if we find any reason to... Get away from there. This is a sign up for the witch house. It's different from what I'm used to. It's because it's old. Let's get rid of the weed first. It's so... It's too much. It would take forever to pull this out by hand. Uh, take a look at the bin over there. Uh, it might have a potion to get rid of the weed. Bin? something here then we have to use another tool it's another tool uh, there, yes there's a wonderful tool our hands what's that your hands ah uh -huh. Rubbish or just a bin bag? I kind of think this is rubbish, but it's not. Whatever this is, this is adorable. That is what it is. It's adorable. 
Look, Ellie, it's a quest mark. All I see is dust and cobwebs that we have to clean up. Exactly. <laughs> Let's find something useful while clean while cleaning. Oh, it's a notebook. Might be useful later. It's really messed. Uh, it's a really. She really messed up the house. It reminds me of your room. My room was cleaner than this. That might be. <laughs> that might be so from a dust standpoint. So which bookshelf? Technically, it's a bookshelf that with <laughs> that the witch was using. The same as a witch bookshelf. I'm not going to read the book though. I'm tired of books. A poisonous mushroom is better than a witch who doesn't read books. What does that mean? Because a poison mushroom kills for just one per <laughs> kills just one person. <laughs> Stop nagging it. I read uh, enough book at school. Hmm, witch history, the 12 plants, fun book of plants, gathering for witches. There are so many books on plants. I guess a witch who used to research plants was living here. I should store uh, I should store any um, books I get in here. That's cool. I wonder uh, where the witch is, the one who used to live here. This, pra this, uh, this pl uh, place is probably very old. She must be eating and living well somewhere uh, in Lucterine Auto. All done cleaning. So messy in front of the desk over there, Ellie. Stop bossing me around like the teacher. I finally managed to get out of this school. There's some dust over here, Ellie. Don't leave food behind, Ellie. I told you not to go inside the principal's office, Ellie. You should have listened. <laughs> Oh, this is which elevator? Uh, that's why you have to listen to the teachers. Let's hurry up and go down. What if there's a, a scary monster? You think so? Well, I'm so excited. <laughs> the witch's workplace. Oh god, this is suddenly very big. Oh, look at this, Virgil. I had a hiccup in there. Look at this. Uh, this must be the dis uh, dispensary. You can probably make potions uh, with the proper tools. We should uh, definitely do some cleaning. Wow, cleaning again. Which flower extract? I don't have uh, any any room left in my inventory. Look at the glass bottle underneath. Oh, that tree is broken. It, it, uh, it, I'll need a friendly toad at least. I'll need to get a glass bottle first in order to use this. You need at least to fix the extractor in order to make potions. Alright, let's go to the vi village first. Let's look for one. What's the village? The village. Oh, this is a box we can store things in. I can put stuff in my pockets in here. I don't know what to do with the witch, witch flower extra. I apparently can't put that in there. Squishy uh, bug witch extract. Uh, what kind of stores is this in comparison? Oh, it's a cauldron. It's a pretty good cauldron. Oh, how did it go? It's a double, double toiling trouble, uh, trouble. Um, put this cauldron and make it bubble. Use this cauldron to make it bubble or something like that. I think it was made by the, the blue uh, lighting workshop. Its style is very traditional. I've only ever used the sheep cauldrons at school. Finally, I get to use a good one. You remember how to use one? Of course! Expertly uh, processing... Uh, pro uh, expertly uh, processed... In oh. Expertly processed ingredients. The exact heat intensity and the la uh, lad uh, ladling technique. 
And at last, at last you'll end up with a proper potion. Nice. I actually like Teacher Olivia. Still, the, the cauldron looks fine. You'll be able to make a potion if you have the ingredients. The machine tools are in bad condition though. Uh, since there are some um, discarded, uh, since there are some discarded ingredients, let's make a potion. We need to using them for now. Okay, so we can get something we can uh, use to get the. This is a potion ingredient, isn't it? Uh, are witches usually this sloppy? Sloppy or not, they're careful with their ingredients. I guess the witch uh, that lived here was really sloppy. Or she was in a hurry. Why? Beats me. A roaster? Oh, I hate this thing. You have to put the ingredients and just wait. It's awful. Can't you simply just put them and do something else be while while you're waiting? You seem to be in bad condition, however. Really? Oh yes, there's no hand handle for win winding the spring. Now, um, where would a roster? Uh, where would I get the roster handle? Uh, I don't need the roster since um, it's not needed for the basic recipes. There should be something um, when you get to the village. Yeah, the village came first. Comes first. By the way, there's nothing normal here. Um, it would be rather strange to be normal when it's dirty like this. So the cauldron is fine. Let me have the ingredient list, research table. This uh, oh, the spill bottle, scribbled paper, and a book. What a mess! Just brush off the dust. Just brushing off the dust might uh, take a lifetime. What's this? Lunar oil. It looks like a re recipe potion. I guess it was used by the witch who was here. It reads a potion with the power of moon. The ingredients are moonflower and phoenix feather. Only very expensive materials are used. I'll use it someday. Let's have uh, let's have it ready for now. It's also something underneath. Where? Oh, you're right. I don't know what kind of text this is. You learned it at school. It's an ancient witch language. You mean I learned how to read these strange symbols? Your score wasn't bad either. I don't remember anything. Shall we take another uh, a look anyway? Hmm, it looks like a recipe. Seems like moon something. Yeah, I have no idea. I got a headache. He's so dense. Take a look. Um, take a look if you remember later. Unreadable memo. Yeah, I should put it away and revisit it later. This desk would be nice to use as a workbench later. There's no use for it now. Let's uh, look at the recipes then. Yes, I'm done cleaning. We can make potions now. You should... Um, it would be hard to make prop uh, properly because the machine's broken tools. Since there are ingredients on the f ground, so let's try making um, with them for now. There was a little honey pumpkin in front of the village. The stubborn weed eliminator, uh, elimination potion should do it, right? It's a weed terminator potion. Whatever. Shake it in the, uh, shake it in the recipe encyclopedia. You'll probably be able to make it with uh, the ingredients you were lucky enough to find. All right, let's do it. Let's see here. Uh, weed Terminator Encyclopedia. Let's see. Put two squishy shrub fur in the extractor and squeeze the juice. Put two witch flower in the extractor and squeeze the juice. Uh, that's how you get the extracts. Uh, set the fire to four, stir the ladle, don't stir, um, pour the right vessel, tutorial time, uh, ingredients needed is shown here, I think we have two of them, we have quite a few of those as well, uh, put the squishy for, okay, Try crafting the, the weed termination potion using witch flower extract and shubby, bun shubby bunny extract.
and set the thing to four is already set to four whoosh oh that's adorable weed termination potion awesome the seven weed extermination potion is complete a potion for removing weeds anyway it's, it's ready let's throw uh, it in an um, at the little honey pumpkin you must uh, use it carefully since there's no more ingredients okay don't worry you must throw it at the little hum uh, little honey pumpkin and uh, make sure to remove the nucleus as well because the weed terminates potion is a temporary measure got it change potions that's a very nice looking potion See here, switch inventory. Um, I need one more of these to make another one, and then we need two of these. I was thinking how to make um, one for myself later, because there's a second place we can go with it as well. Save and load. You can now load from the cabinet for in witch house. Let's do that. I'm not sleepy yet. You can take naps. Uh, you cannot take naps at night. You can only take naps once per year a day. Oh, I can. Oh, we're talking about uh, doing the weeds. It's gonna take ages. Just looking at my energy, just going down. I could use a uh, crab apples or cranberry apples, what it was called, as a as a way of um, storing energy. I think. All right, I think uh, I got rid of all of them. All of them, right? It's nice to see that it's clean. It's getting late. Had a little nap. And... Here it is. Aim with left trigger. Here it goes. I think it's working properly. I'll just pass it quickly and find a nucleus in the meantime. I want to draw the nucleus. Oh, I can't really. Um... It's so dark at 6 p.m. Oh, why you? Hello. Huh? This isn't a village. Look over there, Ellie. It's a pickle vine that. Um, it's a prickly vine this time. It's so huge and thick. Oh no. What do I do with the extractor? First, take a look around here. Hello. Do you live in the town? Nature is so beautiful. What? Aren't the trees beautiful? The green leaves are so pretty. Oh, sure. Nature is so breathtaking. You must love nature, I guess. How can you not? Okay, I'll be back. Walk under the blue sky and experience nature. She must really love nature. So much that she can't have another conversation? You should respect her in respect her interests. Yes, you should respect her interests. I think it's more of an obsession. Uh-huh. Something didn't feel right. I think she's cursed or something? A curse? That doesn't allow her to talk about anything except nature. A curse of a nature lover. That doesn't make sense. There are lots of Quaker witches out there. 
The curse lifting candy that can lift the curse should be a basic recipe. Oh, but we can't use machine thinging now. I must process what's been collected to uh, make a potion. What should I do? You picked up several ingredients at the workplace earlier, didn't you? Those would be enough to make a curse lifting candy. And did you see what's next to her over there? Next to her, what? It's a glass bottle that it would be perfect as a glass extractor bottle. Where? Oh wow, you were you weren't kidding. All right, let's make a curse lifting po uh, candy to lift the curse, and to receive that glass bottle as a reward. That would be nice. First, let's check on the candy that can lift up the curse in the book. Lunar oil. We don't need that. The quest thing. Oh yeah, I see. Sunlight potion. V terminator. Sprout bird. Squishy bub. There we go. Curse lifting candy. Um, squishy fur. Uh, maple herb extractor. Hysteria, the village is just up ahead. We need to find more of those bunnies, I guess, to get more of those fur. Where are you, little squish squishies? Oh, we need to look at the prickly wine first. Whoa, they're really big! Too big for weed terminator potion, I think. Hmm, well, I have to do something else. We'll, ha we'll have to stay at the witch's house for a while. Need to look for a way to get rid of the witch, uh, the, the prickly wines then. It's too late at night for the, um, the bunnies, I think. So you need to come back in the morning. Let's uh, combine what you have, though, first. Well, we have some of the extract already. What do we need, actually? Um, oh, we... Well, we have it already, so we can just cook and toil. Um, fire this tree, don't stir. There we go. There we go. Curse lifting candy. Let's talk to the lady again. It's so dark for being like 7 p.m. though. At least we have someone nearby to talk to. Should I give it a curse lifting candy? Let's give it. We like to try this. May the blessing of nature be with you. Hello? Yes, hello. I am speaking properly now? Yes, I think so. Wow, thank you so much. To hell with nature. <laughs> I guess it really was a curse. I could tell uh, that the old man I met in the western jungle was suspicious, by the way, just by looking at him. Yet I couldn't simply ignore such well-made wooden image of a monkey. After I bought it, I could only talk about praising nature. I tried to speak backward and write, but I can only praise nature. Pure torture. I hope nature just rots and dies. <laughs> Still, I'm glad the curse was easily removed. Oh, thank you so much. My name is Aurea. How long has it been since I said my name? My name is Ellie. I'm an apprentice witch. Oh, did you come to this town to be an apprentice? I was on the train, but I got off for a moment and it left without me. Oh dear. I was uh, about to enter the town, but it's, uh, it's blocked off by the prickly wines. Damn nature! Thankfully, we found an empty witch house nearby, so I've been staying there. 
An empty... Oh, yes, there, there's a witch house there. That's good. Um, I have business in the village too, but the vine stopped me. Nature be damned. I'll be here for a while, so let me know if you need anything. Okay, then, can I ask you for a favor? Not a favor, but a fair price. What do you need? Uh, the tools were broken when I was trying to use the dispensary at the witch's house. Do you have any tools or parts? What kind of tools and parts do you need? I need a glass bottle for the extractor and a roast, roaster handler handle for the winding the roaster. Um, wait a minute, I'll look for them. Sure. But Ellie, do you have any money? I do, mom gave me pocket money when I came out. And I spent it all on the, the food I ate at the, the train, I guess. You think you'll be able to buy witch tools with just enough pocket money to buy snacks or two? Uh, is that so? What if I don't have what if I don't have enough money? Since you have the tools to make and sell potions or something. You can also sell candies now. Um if only there were people who to buy them. I found it! Take this. How much is this? Oh never mind, this is return for breaking my curse. Wow, thank god. <laughs> Unfortunately I don't have any roaster handle for the roaster. I see. Um Will you be staying in, at the village? If so, I'll bring it next time. I'll sell it proper. Pr uh, pro uh, I will sell it at a proper price. Then, however, I'll sell it at a proper price. Then, however, good. Please bring it then. Okay, I'll write the roaster handle in the memo. Oh, and take this too. Healing candy. Candy. Since the price for the bottle uh, early wasn't enough, I'll give you this um, to you as well. Thank you. Sure, come back next time. Now that we'll be able to fix the extractor. But are you really going to stay in this village? I should until the train comes. Really? I have no choice. No, I mean, are you really going to leave uh, when the train comes? That, um... I'll decide when that happens. Let's just fix the extractor first. Welcome. Do you need anything? Uh, shit chat. My love, my beautiful love. I look for you in the morning sun, broken by the waves. Oh my love, my dazzling love. What kind of song is that? It's a song that sailors sing. Uh, when I sing it, it's nice, it's nice to feel like I'm back in those days. My love, my beautiful love. I look at you in the sailors blown, in the sails blown up by the large, by the breeze. Breeze. Oh my love, my warm love. Do you need anything? Don't have any items. Backstory. Uh, do you know uh, when I feel the happiest is when working as a peddler. I'm assuming it's when it's prof f profitable. Profitable. When I see the product properly, um, I feel the best when I find something pr precious amongst the the things laid out randomly by the country market. Then, is it a big gain? You can buy it cheap and sell it. I can't do that. A good product must be bought at a good price. But the other person didn't know. But I knew. Wait, uh, what if you were wrong? Then I have only my poor eyes to blame. Aren't you being too nice in doing business? It's been a really long time since I've heard that I'm nice. Don't worry. It's a matter of my conviction rather than how nice I am. I earned enough to get by. Uh, do you need anything? See you next time. All right, let's uh, see what we can do here. Can I draw anything here with um? The quill? I haven't found everything yet, so I guess we have to continue our search around here. Oh shoot, what's that? A pumpkin terrier? Um, lives at the pumpkin tire plants. Uh, loves, it loves to play, but um, so we'll try to hide and seek if you attempt to collect from them.
That's cute. Pumpkin terrier fur. I'll grab a couple of these. That's cute. So they're not harmful. I thought like by the, the way they look, they would be harm, like harmful or something. But apparently not. Also, they expect that when I was walking here. Gimme, gimme. Not getting away, you. So, there is a thing up here somewhere, I'm sure. Um, that we need another um, wilter thing, this. So we can get through here if you just have uh, some extract stuff we can use. So I might be doing that, make some extract from some of the stuff we had so far. But I do need one um, squishy bunny to do it. And I don't have any shock either, so um, I can't go through those areas yet. It's also getting late, so um, I'm just looking at my... Um... Should I use the glass pot for the, uh, I have for the extractor? Yes. You can finally make potion properly. What do I do now? Um, didn't you want to go to the village? You should remove the, the gigantic prickly vine. That's true, but um, it seemed impossible to get rid of that huge thing with the recipe I have now. The basic recipe um, does not seem kind of inadequate. Uh, what, what's your plan? Now that we have the extractor. Um, now that the extractor is fixed, you will be able to make potion from basic recipes. If you make weed terminate the potion, you can get rid of little honey pumpkin. I'll be able to go places that have been uh, blocked. Little more, yeah. So uh, the for so the forest. Let's look through the forest, and there must be something. That's what I'm saying. So we need the squishy squish. There you go. So let's see here. We have. see swap items and let's see we need these and we need these and we need these Make as many as we can right now. And then we have a squishy fur bunny. We need one more, I think, to, in order to... No, do we? I can't remember if we need... Um, healing candy. We can sell this, I guess. Um... Weed Terminator, um, 
two squishy flower two fur baby uh, fur squish squishy hubs so we don't have two squishy hubs we need one more squishy hub fur for that and that is broken still let's fill up with these At least this isn't, doesn't take anything from my um, my energy, but it does take time. It's almost midnight. So I think uh, if it's anything like Stardew, we'll, we'll lose um, all the time we have in the end. Okay, so we can put these in there. don't have anything that requires the, the, the terrier fur there we go oh it's sleepy time my bad uh, you just woke up why do you look dead already I think I had an important dream but I can't remember it it seems like something important. Like the printable sermon? That's something I don't want to think about again. So I guess like midnight is around the time you'll fall asleep. Right, it's saved. Ka. A crow? Which? Ka. It, it spoke. Oh, it's right next to me. That's cute. Like a little uh, purple glow around it. A witch crow. Oh, it's a witch crow. The witch returns. The witch returns. What? It's my first time coming here, though. The witch returns. That's exactly a listener, isn't he? Good and service. Ka. Good and services. Witch's catalog. <laughs> the witch's catalog. I've always wanted to try it out. You need to head towards Highline, young lady. But I can't just starve until I reach uh, the village. After I find the village, I'm going to make sure I try it out before I go to Highline. Limited time only. Register now for a gift car. Try the witch's catalog. Try the witch's catalog. <laughs> and you're handing out gifts as well? Plus it's limited time only? We car gift. Multipurpose glue, kitchen accessories, a spork? In any case, I need the witch's catalog. I guess it wouldn't hurt to have it, uh, have it in a pinch. You can buy ingredients or potion recipes from them. Alright, let's register for now. Thank you, Ka, thank you. Visit employee, visit employee. Ka, visit employee. When? Work finished, work finished. Close for the day. Close for the day. <laughs> what? So suddenly? It's not easy getting the message across to witches crows. Uh, then I guess I could keep searching for the village. You never know when the witches catalog will show up. Let's stick uh, to the plan and find a village. Ka, dum dum, ka. Squish, squish. Oh, he wants to play too. Squish, squish. Squish, squish. And another squish, squish. can do that right now, I guess. So I need uh, two...
There we go. And that will be the extractor, right? We terminate there. There we go. This is what we need. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave some of the extract down here, so I can come back with uh, an empty, and then uh, go out and explore with an empty uh, backpack. I'll keep this in case I get out of breath. But I think it's gonna be a problem, really. Employee car. Hello? That's a terrier again. I don't know what I need him for, really, yet. Virgin, look at that! It's grown so much. That wasn't uh, that wasn't big a while ago. That must be an adult honey pumpkin. We better get rid of it before it grows any more. Well, I'm not even I, I'm not even a gardener. Why? We must get rid of it to get a new uh, to a new place since we haven't been behind there. Oh, I guess I can be helped. I guess to it can be helped to get a new place. I guess I should make weed terminator potion. It's simple because I made it once before. Don't forget to remove the nucleus after you want, um, want if you want to avoid repeating the same thing. All right, I guess. X was it, right? There we go. Plippity plop. And plop. Now we got a new area. Oh, look at that fox being tra uh, trapped over there. That, that's sad. We should go and help him. Seems to be vine over here to get down. Oh, I seem to be a whole way around. Okay, this place is stopped by now, but we should definitely go and save this guy. But first, I'm gonna draw him. Rubrum. Oh, Virgil, there's someone stuck in the spider web. I think it's lost consciousness. Is he even alive? I don't know. Um. Gah! <laughs> they woke up. Woo! Who? I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. A witch? Wow, this is my first time seeing an apprentice witch. It's my first time seeing someone caught in the spider web. <laughs> my name is Rubrum. I live in the village with uh, with my grandma, but now I'm stuck in the big spider web. He doesn't seem to understand the gravity of this, his situation. A big spider web means a big spider nearby. <gasps> what? Gasp! You be you be quiet. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'll help you down. Have to be careful when dealing with spider webs, Ellie. It looks pretty strong. Uh, one move and you'll be stuck in it yourself. Then what do I do? Maple herb works best against insects. Uh, just one maple herb should be enough. I learned that maple herb grows to the cliff. I'll bring one soon. Yeah, come back soon. I just put. I just made all the money into extracts. And when we come back, he's dead. He's eaten. He's devoured. Poor thing. It's almost like a secret over here. Oh, I saw a clipping issue. 
Look at that. He clipped through here. <laughs> Must be a uh, wrong uh, something wrong with the script, I guess. Wait, I could draw that. Drawing with your quill. Rebrum. Can I draw that one too? I don't think I can draw that one. That's uh, the mango I can use for eating. Okay, so right bumper is running, left bumper is walking slow. Like this? Oh. Let's help him. Are you okay? Yeah, probably. Can you walk? Okay. Then let's go um, to the witch house together. I have a friendo. Oh, this only needs a shock I don't have. So I guess at some point I'll learn how to draw um, craft shocks. Come on, Rebrum, you're slow as fuck. Let's check on Rebrum first. Hello, Ellie. Any inter interesting stories? I'm worried about uh, which tea leaf to brew. Any interesting stories? Ellie, do you like tea? Yes. I like it. Well, well let's drink some tea later. I'll give you some uh, delicious tea. Yeah, okay. She's just, he's just laying on the ground there. Any interesting stories? My name is Rubrum. It's a name given to me by my grandma. The name suits you well. Thanks. Any interesting stories? Goodbye. Rub rum. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I can't walk because my legs hurt. Probably, um, we, you were probably up there for too long. Then I'll give you a hug. I'll give you a treatment at the witch house. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm carrying him. Well, I can collect the stones. Don't worry, little fox. I'll bring you home and fatten you up and then we'll eat you for supper. Isn't it heavy? Of course. Really? Just stop talking. Not far along now. Our will is just a little further from here. But you cannot pass through now because of the prickly wines. Let's go to the witch's house for now and find a way. Yeah. Yeah. We're here. Wow, a witch's house. Thanks. How's your leg? It still hurts a bit. I have to hurry up and get back to the village. If not, my grandma will scold me. Leave it to me. I'll get, the I'll get rid of the huge prickly wine. Well, really? I'll make sure to get... Um, uh, get you back to your village. Don't worry. Okay, thanks. Before that, uh, we should treat your leg first. Rebram, wait here a moment. Right. Well, uh, I'm gonna go back to the the mountain because I saw some stones I could pick up. I I didn't know existed. By the way, I need to actually heal his leg before I can do anything. There was some stones here I saw. Piece of rock. Ooh, piece of rock. Ooh, piece of rock. Right, we have some stuff. Um, I th do I have enough to make the wetland grass? 
Little mandrake, wetland grass. Blue bubble lizard. Pom pom, one eyed frog, tinkle spider. <laughs> tinkle. Nutrition potion, silver star juice, pink star juice. Cure detection candy. Alright, I guess it wants me to create one of those healing thingies now. And what do I need for the healing candy? Uh, witch flower extract and maple herb extract. I think I have a little bit of both. How many? Uh, two and two herbs. That's cool. I think I have both. Oh, well, how much? Uh, stage four, sturdy ladle right. Um, yeah, and there was two. There we go. Some healing candy. Put whatever you have left of the maple syrup in here. I don't know if I should be eating the apples or just keep them. Would you like to try this? Wow, what's this? It's, it's a candy? Yeah, it's a candy to heal your leg. Wow, thanks. Look, it looks delicious. Oh, it is delicious. Oh, this tastes awful. Ugh. <laughs> it's good for your health. <laughs> How's your leg? Well, I think I feel better. Thanks, Ellie. The candy tastes awful. <laughs> so, did you uh, get caught? How did you get caught in a spider web? I just came to the forest to play for a little bit. But uh, time flew by, and uh, then a giant prickly vines were covering the way. I was looking for another path when I heard the sound of a train. Oh, it must be the one I was riding. It went towards the train and the strange bird suddenly started chasing after me. It must have been uh, that bird, not the train. It was that bird. It went into a deep place uh, it, as, a, uh, as I was run. I went, in, I went to the deep place as I was running away. Then I found a treasure map and got caught in the spiderweb as I was trying to pick it up. Treasure map? I saw a picture of a skeleton uh, through the bushes. I saw a children's book uh, that it that it's a sign of pirate leaving a treasure. <laughs> Shall we go check? What about a gigantic prickly vine? Oh well, we can't do much about it yet. It would uh, wouldn't hurt to try. Uh, it wouldn't hurt to try. Let's go. Ellie, can I follow you too? Wouldn't be uh, getting better. Uh, oh. Wouldn't it be better to get a little bit rest first? I'm bored since I'm at home all the time. What do you say? Okay, fine, but careful. Okay, thanks. Gonna say hi to the spider now. Okay, so you're not falling with us. All right, let's see if we can do anything about that spider map. Oh, there he is. It's just a slow poke. Oh, there's something in a bush right next to it. See? A boom potion! I even went to a hidden library because I wanted to make it. I'm so lucky to find this here. They don't normally use skeleton design as a symbol of luck, right? The important thing is that now I have something to blow the things up with. And also something to blow up. <laughs> You're super excited. And shall we try it right away? We're gonna boom up the, uh, the gate. I miss this feeling. 
Um, do you plan to destroy everything on top of, um, on the top of getting into trouble? Hey, what do you take me for? Boom potion, don't uh, you feel the almighty power just from the name? When in trouble, throw it. Uh, break it if you uh, you can't have it. Break it if you can't have it. Something it takes boldness to overcome in crisis. Uh, don't you think it's strange that a boom potion was dropped um, in that secluded forest? Someone might have hidden it, thinking it w it's a treasure like rubrum. Or someone might have spilled it. The boom potion? Uh, I don't know. Um, the important thing is now that the boom potion is in my hands. Go, boom potion! I choose you! Pika boom! Oh, it won't budge. Uh, it must be stronger than the secret door in the principal office. What, uh, what are these fragments coming out of it? Huh? Where? Around your feet. Look at this, Virgil. A prickly wine fragment. It seems to be work a little bit. The wines appear to have grown back pretty fast. It might be able to figure out exactly what prickly wines are. These prickly wines aren't even in the codex. How are you going to figure out? Hmm, well... Oh, wouldn't a, a person living around here know something? Let's show the fragment to someone and ask him about it. Any interesting stories? Yeah, prickly wine. Is it a prickly wine fragment? Fascinating. Do you happen to know something about it? No, I don't. Oh, okay. Any interesting stories? Okay, goodbye. I'm gonna show her plants and she hates nature. Oh, this is a fragment of that prickly wine? Yes, that's right. Do you know anything about it? No, I don't know anything about it. Prickly ones either. But I have something that uh, might be helpful. Something that might be helpful? Uh, Ta-da! An universal product of appraisal machine. Oh, wow, well, that's... What's that? It's a tool made by some witch. Uh, with the power of moon and the moonstone embedded here, you can find out the, the identity of the object. Really? Then hurry up and try it. I don't usually do this for free, but since you lifted my curse, I'll do it for free this time. Wow, that's great. All right, here he goes. Huh? What? The prickly wine fragment has disappeared. That's strange. What did it, why did it disappear? Maybe because of a grudge against nature? No, that's not possible. This tool just shoots moonlight and analyzes reflected light. Oh, so during the night we might actually use it. No, 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 I know. Um, moonlight potion. The thing we have a main quest to do. There are no plants um, that just killed by moonlight, right? A plant that gets killed by moonlight. Uh, it seems like something's coming up in my mind. Tinky tank, tinky tink. Think, Ellie, this is something you learned in school. Well, I remember now. Avoiding the moon, there are plants that get killed by moonlight. That's right, this prickly wine definitely avoids the moon. That's why it died in moonlight. I think I've also heard of plants like that. I'm glad it's... Uh, I'm glad the tool is working fine. Thank you. I think I can get rid of the prickly vines now. No, I'm the one who should be thankful. Work hard. You need anything? No, I'm good. So, uh, let's see, we need potion, and we need to find out how to make that, um, moonlight, lunar oil, um, put one moonflower in the extractor, phoenix feather powder, how do you find these things, maple flower, squishy fur, sunlight, used when fleeing from dangerous animals, plants, monsters, human, witches, fur, fruits, clouds, rocks, and tornadoes with eyes. That doesn't sound good. Squishy fur. Squish the fur. I can't squish it. 
All right, let's have another gander at the spider place. Maybe during the night, uh, something changes. Oh no, it says something about searching the, the drawers in the witch's house. So let's do that first if you're already here. I think it's all about um, just following the quest for now. At some point, it will leave you to your own uh, demise, I guess. Squish, squish. I hope I get to uh, work on this some time later. It's pretty... Oh, uh, was it this thing? No. Maybe the bookshelf. Or the log. Alright, <laughs> All right, let's get this started. The moonflower. People have died from reading too many books, haven't they? So much for all the confidence. I actually have a disease that kills me if I read too many books, you know. Stop complaining and uh, keep searching. You only have gone through three books so far. Only? Come on. Look at the size of these books. It's too much work. Can't you read instead? You sure you want to, you sure you want to do that? Of course. We're friends, right? Looks like the next few lines are about Moonflower. What? Really? Let's see here. A bitter grape tree, uh, tea tree. A bitter grape tea tree. Have you heard that before? Is that the the, tr the tree on the bit top? That's the tree we saw at the summit, the glowing one, the glowing uh the gold come from the uh, blue moon butterflies. Hmm. The tea leaves, blah blah blah, taste like grapes. Strong bitter taste. Oh, here it is. Blah blah blah. It's also famous for its flowers, the moon flowers. Moonflower? So he so he was here. There's still more information. Hmm. He got his moonlight most of the time and um on moonless night the moonflower flower blooms. A moonless night. There uh, the tree in the summit had blue and blue moon butterflies around it. So blue uh so moonflower couldn't bloom because the moon light emitted by the blue moon butterflies. So if you get the blue moon butterflies, get rid of them, the blue, uh, the, the moon flower will bloom. Yeah, that's commonly used met method back in luck, uh, Lucterine. Lucerine, Lucterine. I'll call it Lucterine. Or two. Gather moonlight with the blue uh, moon butterflies. Sh uh, shoot them away and collect the moon, uh, moon flower. All right, let's get rid of the mo blue moon butterflies. Uh, make lunar oil, uh, remove... Rem um, and remove the prickly vines. But what do we use to get rid of the blue uh, moon butterflies? Sunlight, yeah. And to do that, I need two of everything. What do I have? Um, actually, I think I have everything. I need to make uh, one more of these. And to make the sunlight potion, we need witch flower, maple herb, and squishy fur extract. Stage five fire and ladle right. Stage four, ladle right. Bam, 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 bam. Don't worry, uh, I already have the ingredients. You already have them? First, the moonflower. You really want to go now? Uh, do uh, Did you do everything you want to do? Uh, yeah, let's go now. There's nothing more to do. Let's go. Great, uh, the stuck of the tree as expected. 
Oh, there are tons of shining butterflies. Uh, you're going to make them sh uh, shoot them all away, right? You're going to shoot them all away now, right? I feel bad for them uh, all of a sudden. It's for the treat's sake. Hurry up and sprinkle the potion. Okay, here he goes. Yeet. Ooh, bright. Flower time. Wow, it's beautiful. Where the where are the butterflies going? Wouldn't they go back to where they came from? But the flower. Oh, over there, over here. Yeah, everywhere. It's so beautiful. Yes, it really is beautiful. Now we can just pick them. Uh, we can just pick them up and make the lunar oil. Uh, Rubrum, uh, can you go to the prickly ones and wait for us there? We'll come as soon as the moon oil is ready. Oh, okay. I'll wait. I'll be waiting in front of the vines. All right. So let's go to the dispensary. Ba -ba -ba -bum. The music is everywhere. I hope you haven't forgotten. For lunar oil, uh, you need phoenix feather. There's no way you can find a phoenix fe a phoenix around here. But we have a phoenix feather right here. You told me all about it earlier. What? It <laughs> Ellie, that's not a good idea. Oh, that's uh, my train ticket. If we do that, we might not be able to go back to the train. We might not make it to the High Lion. Our witches are always ready to help, starting, starting with the ones who need, the, need it the most. That again? You just like like it here better? Of, well, of course. You just doing, uh, don't like the witch house in High Lion. <laughs> That's true. Stop being childish. You're going to regret it later. No, Virgil. What I, will, what I will regret is not doing this right now. I'm sure of it. You have to be smart about this. <laughs> Oops. Phoenix was made by the powder. Oh, great. I have all the ingredients now. Ellie, you're worse than Aria sometimes. Oh, please. I'm nowhere near as good as my mother. That wasn't a compliment. All right, now let's make the lunar oil. The need for the lunar oil then. Um, sage one, don't stir. Oh, I need to actually extract it. There we go. And Phoenix and don't stir. There we go. Lunar oil. Woohoo, the lunar oil is ready. Let's go get rid of the prickly wine now. I'm here, let's hurry up and get rid of the annoying vines. Um, huh? Did you happen to suffer somehow because of me? Don't worry about that. This was my choice, and I, uh, what I really wanted to do. And this was my choice. Where's the, uh, the lady? Thanks, Ellie. It's not a big deal. You can uh, you can come from to the witch house anytime you want. Are you going to stay here? Yeah, I think I'll keep staying here as an apprentice. Really? 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 Keep up the good work, Rubrum. Okay. <laughs> keep up the good work too, Ellie. Hurry and go home for now. Your grandma must be worried. I'll find you later. Okay, see you in a bit. Yeah. About that. Quit acting like a saint. This place seems fun to you, that's all. Virgil, try not to say stuff like that makes me sound like the bad guy, will you? It's a happy ending for all that I uh, for all if I have fun and they're happy, isn't it? Do the teachers get angry? Like mother, like daughter, that's what they'll all say. Uh, that's great. I already told you, it's not a compliment. Alright, let's head to the village. 
for some reason I thought like this was the end of like uh, early access or something. I really have arrived at the village. Yeah, it is a village. What kind of village? What kind of village would it be? I hope it's a lot of fun happen there. It would be a lot of annoying things to take care of. I was always expecting something like that. Let's hurry up and go. It's 10 p.m., so I'm gonna go and have a, a sleep first. Our friend disappeared, though. I'm gonna first go down and get rid of everything in my inventory I don't need. I don't really need the apples around here. Moon is something I need to keep a uh, hold of just in case because that seems to be a pain to get sorted. Let's go to the village first. What is 10 p.m.? What are we going to do at the village at 10 p.m.? Also, it seems like the time has stopped. Uh, it's quite a dull sight. Virgil? How's the village that you have to stay in for... How's the village that you have to stay in for three years? You feel like you're going back to Highline again? What the heck happened here? What's this evil prickly vine? I'm so excited. I don't even know where to start. And something it seems strange. It's strange for anyone who uh, see... Uh, strange for anyone to see the prickly vines growing only on houses. No, that's not what I meant. It feels like I've been here before, for uh, before some, for some reason. What kind of useless double meeting is that? There's no way you've ever been here before. They uh, don't come this far uh, for the witch school picnic. Something feels familiar. Let's find Rubrum first. Whatever happened to these? Ruins. The decorations look gorgeous. <laughs> what happened to the uh, people who used to live here? Uh, wouldn't they have run away uh, while the prickly vine was growing? I hope that was the case. It makes me feel a little bit like... I think the game was... Um, Secret of Mana? No. Something like that. Because it was um, a game I was playing not too long ago where the village was just a ruin and people were hiding because of the the overgrowth. Reminds me of that. How long was he away? Closed. I guess it's a restaurant. This house looks. This house looks fine. This house. Um, a restaurant in a village like this. Can you do business in a place like this? Seems like someone's here, right? The fountain that's just broken. Oh, Ellie. Thanks for helping me get home. That's nothing special. But it it's but it really looks like no one's in the village. Yes, many of them left after the prickly vines have grown. Now we only uh, have Uncle Arden and my ma and my house. Um, I see. You must be bored. No, it's okay because Grandma and Uncle Arden are here. They are also a lot of fun things in the forest. Oh, and uh, oh, Grandma wants to meet you. Grandma? Yes, she's in the village. She she's a village chief. She's a village chief. Um, they say not these. Uh, they say not in these times, but she's still the village chief. She's right behind me. Okay, I'll go. Uh, take care. There she is. Her grandma is a goat. Seems weird. Temple of the Cat God. Based on the sign, it should have been a road. 
The side is broken and the road is blocked. Maybe God is angry. Does it look like God is angry? That is broken. Hello, pot. A bag dropped here. People are so sloppy. It's Arden's. Let's take it uh, for now and uh, try to find the owner. So Arden is the uh, the restaurant owner, I guess. Uh, the, the bartender was talking about Arden. And someone else. I guess we see Arden at some other time. And eat. Welcome, witch. You've done a great job with helping my grandchild. Thank you. Uh, no, I'm the one who received help. You can speak comfortably. Uh, I'm Ellie, the apprentice witch. Many witches look different uh, from their age. All right, I shall speak comfortable, uh, comfortably, Ellie. Welcome to Vesteria. I'm Enite, the chief of the village. Even though both the village chief and the village are in bad shape, what happened to this village? What are all those prickly vines? Did you take a look around the village? Yes, I saw the house was covered with prickly vines. They didn't look like ordinary prickly vines. One day three years ago, those prickly vines started uh, to grow all of a sudden and destroyed the house one by one. Why did the prickly vines start growing all of a sudden? Actually, there were already prickly vines growing in the village. The white prickly wine uh, at the village entrance was the one originally growing at the village. A lot of villages in one sentence there. Uh, but I only saw the prickly vines that started growing for the first time three years ago. At first they were s saying uh, like, God's punishment, monster, witch curse. Wipe off your drool, Ellie. You're seri <laughs> it's a serious story. There are lots of rumors now, but um, no one is actually no one actually knew why. They start growing all of a sudden without any explanation. What happened to the village? Or oh, villagers? Nobody was hurt. The prickly vines grew fast for a plant, but not fast enough to hurt anyone. Even so, people had uh, no place to live anymore. Left the village inevitably. Now only Arden and I are left to protect the village. Don't worry now, I'll help you. I'll remove the prickly vines and bring the village back together. Thank you so much for saying that. But it's too late now. What? All the houses have been ruined already. And everyone left. It's not a village, uh, but two people with a lot of regrets and regrets are protecting the ruins. Ellie, um, you should also leave now. The better to go to the place you were originally planning to go. Well, I can't do that in there yet. I, I used my, my ticket now, but I'm not forcing you. You can stay the, uh, in the village for as long as you want, but leave when the train comes. This place is not a village anymore. Th that can't happen. Highlighting is boring as hell. So the hat agrees with, <laughs> agrees with us on that one. Virgin, bad word. Ellie, there are no more people here. Even if the prickly ones were removed, nothing remains. This is still a village. Even the people who had left uh, would want to come back. Even if the prickly ones disappear, why would they come back to a village like this? Everyone would want to come back. But Ellie, people left and the time has passed. I don't think those driven uh, out by the prickly ones will ever want to come back to these ruins. No, they would definitely want to come back. It's a, wonder, a wonderful village that you have been cultivating all your life, e -night. I can't let the village be taken away by these weird prickly wines. Yeah, you're right, but... Phew, let's go sleep for now uh, and talk again tomorrow. Um, you look tired too. Rubberm looks like he needs a rest as well. Okay. Don't scold Rubberm too much. Yeah, okay, let's get some rest. You should too, e -night. The 
think uh, everyone here is sorted then. This is close. We'll come back and give him his uh, his bag later. What are you trying to do? He not is right. It requires a lot of imagination to call this place a village. It's still a village, even if there are no houses. Yeah, but it's not a village if there are no people. The people will come back. How can you be so sure? This is your first time in the village. If you're just being, you just, <laughs> if you're just being ridiculous. No, I definitely heard it. The villagers want to come back. The villagers want to come back. Where did you hear it? You didn't even see the villager. Mm, that's, I don't know. Maybe I heard it, in a, heard it in a dream. That's absurd. No. It's absurd. No, it isn't. It's a village that Enite has lived in for all her life. Other people would also have loved the village as much as Enite. You know, you also just met Enite for the first time. I can tell even if you met for the first time. It was someone, uh, some kind of throbbing feeling. Who would fix the house even if the prickly vines were removed? There are two old, uh, two old people and one child remaining. You're right, Virgil. Correct. You need a carpenter, carpenter to fix the house. The first person returning to be has to be a carpenter. I wish a carpenter could fly if possible. It would be nice if it also had six arms. Don't be sarcastic, Virgil. I guess you should have a deep dream. In order to meet that kind of carpenter. Stop being sarcastic. So I guess uh, we need to get a few of those moon thingies. Also it looks like our friend has left. Maybe she's only here on certain days. I'll keep a hold on Arden's bag for now. It's 8 a.m. Did you meet the flying carpenter? I don't know. It seems like I did have a dream, but I don't remember anything. Are you nervous of something? Since this is your first day as a, an apprentice witch? Of course not. So you're ready to start your first day as an apprentice witch? Of course. Do you know what, you, what, you're, uh, what to do? Let's ask uh, what Enite thinks first. Although she will uh, naturally approve, um, it will start from the moment she approves. I'll check out the carpenter's house and try to get rid of the prickly wines. Remember that we need uh, don't have any phoenix feathers left. It will work out somehow. Let's go to Enite's, um, Enite first. So I guess if uh, we have the guy to make us... Oh, hello. Who are you? Diane? I guess if you had like a... Um, um, like net or something, we could catch some of those butterflies. Hello, this is the Twitch's catalog that gives the most uh, inexpensive product at the best prices. This is Diane Greenwind, who brings happiness. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Hello, I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. Yes, nice to meet you, Ellie. Uh, what I must help you with today is... Oh, uh, you're registering for the first time. Yes, that's right. It must have been in, in uh, inconvenience for you to be able... Uh, to not be able to use the witch's catalog. Just a minute, okay? Thank you for waiting. Uh, so I need uh, to see a mass, see the mass of witch before registering. Uh, registering. Is she inside? Mm, the master witch? Yes, I need a mass of witch signature to register the witch's catalog. Oh, uh, that's um um I'm. Uh... Hey Ellie. Uh huh. Fooling around while I'm out. <laughs> you didn't forget to register with them. Uh -huh. Oh, and I didn't forget. Of course not. I guess the master which is uh, some place else now. Are you talking through the hat? 
Are you talking true that hat? Yes. Stay quiet, Ellie. You unfinished dumb hat of a real rascal. Of a little rascal. Why can't you even do one thing properly? I told you to tell me when the witch's catalog employee comes. I'm sorry, I was just about to tell you. Oh, sure. Uh, then I guess Ellie can just sign instead of... Because the master witch is here. You'll also receive a gift to join. Whoa, a gift? What is it? A witch's broom. That's easy to use. A witch's broom? Finally. You can just sign here and here. Okay, just a minute. They are literally scamming this person. Yes, that, it's, that's it. Um, then I'll explain how to use the witch's catalog. Would you like to hear it? Uh, sure. Uh, please explain. Every morning a witch's catalog employee will come. In this case, it will be me. I'm planning to be here from 8am to 6pm. You can uh, just purchase the item you need for uh, from me during that time. Uh, we do not accept gold coins, only accept Luna coins. Uh, what, what is this thing called? Luna coins? Luna coins are the currency used in witch society. It is called Luna coin because it's made of an ore with the power of the moon. Don't you know? Um, or don't you already know? Since you were here, um, we we're also raised with the witch society, Ellie. I think I learned it in school. It's just that I don't think I called money uh, something else in my life. It's it's five money. <laughs> After all, only Luna coins are used in a witch society. But how do I earn Luna coins? I guess you don't have enough Luna coins. What? Basically, yes. Quack. Quack. Hi, Ducky. The witch's administration is running a service to purchase potions and prepare for such incidents. Please let us know uh, at any time and we will purchase regardless of the type. We can shop. Yes. How are you doing, Ducky? Alright, got it. Um, it is also a special potion deliver delivery s service. And every day the, of the week we buy potions at a higher price. Specific kind of potions, I guess. Uh, you can select one out of three in the list providing um, provided and delivered within two days. But since we're buying at a higher price, uh, don't lose a nice opportunity. Delivery special potion. Um, merchant buy a special potion uh, to specific special rules on top of using potion sales. Deliver requested potions f to get more reward. Because that's, that's both both of them. Well, I guess the one on the left will give us real gold money and the one on the right will give us lunar money. So, do you have any more questions? No, not anymore. Alright, then feel free to talk to me if uh, you need anything. Um, yes, go ahead. The gift? Right, I'll give it to you now. You got a broom. You're doing well. That's cool. Nice. A broom is given uh, as a freebie. It's old, but still useful. Wow, thank you. Finally, my own broom. Uh, ooh, I can ride out quickly, I guess. Have a nice day. This, have a nice day. This has been Diane Greenwind of the Witch's Catalog. Do you think it went well? Yes, it looks like urgent fire is out. How? M <laughs> how was my acting skill? Um, I'm the one who did the acting. You were dumbfounded. Yeah, we are playing cute pixel game. It's the cutest. And it's the best as cutest. <laughs> it was all an act being dumbfounded. This might become a problem <laughs> later on. It's all an act, eh? Eh? Um, I told you I'm good at acting. Uh, no. You are poor. <laughs> Your poor acting skill would have... Uh, but oh. your poor acting skill, but the fact that the master witch is not here, the master witch must be the witch's house. We can't just have an uh, can't just have an apprentice witch. Can't you uh, can't you just keep acting? How long will it work? Uh, there's still the matter of um, the witch who was originally here at this witch's house. It would be nice if we knew uh, who that witch was. The witch who was originally here. Could also be someone with malice. 
Let's ask the villagers later on. Let's deliver potions with the broom uh, for now. You need to get e uh, get to Enite. Oh, you're right. Um, there's no need for urgency. Strange dream. Grunt, she's thinking about something. Diane! Hello, this is a witch's catalog um, that gives you the most inexpensive product at the best prices. This is Diane to bring you happiness. Oh, it's you, Ellie. Welcome. I'm sorry, that was unprofessional of me. Did something happen? Um, I'm not sure it's okay to tell you this, but since uh, we just met... What is it? Maybe I can help. Um, Ellie, do you remember the potion purchase service? Yes. Recently, there was uh, have been several reports of bad potions. Trust in the witch's catalog. Potions quality. Uh, trust the administration. As a result, the administration issued a notice to each catalog, catalog salesperson to test uh, the suspicious potions. The problem is the witch's house I'm in charge of are all related to suspicious potions. As you know, Ellie, potion quality is also a matter of uh, a witch's confidence. You can't do it yourself, Diane. I need a witch to accompany with me uh, to test for uh, for certification. Is that right? Uh, may I ask you for your help? It's a small reward, but uh, I I made some um, new nubicola nubiculous cupcakes. Nubicola cupcakes. My mom would always buy me one for me uh, on weekend if I've been good that week. So naturally, I hardly ever had any so far. <laughs> All right, I'll help. Thank you. Please take this first. A nutrition potion. That's a potion that temporarily supplies a large amount of nutrients to a plant. It's usually used for emerge measure on dying plants. And? A birdcage? To start testing as soon as possible, I also caught this sprout bird. You can throw the nutrition uh, potion on the sprout bird. When the result appears, please gather them um, and take a look. Then I'll record the details, like the date, weather, time, and direction, etc. Also, please let me know if you make a bad throw. You're very serious about this. One, two, three, four. Four new flowers have bloomed? Hmm, moderate temperature, mild wind, and low humidity. Great, fortunately the potions here seem normal. Uh, it went well, right? Yes, we can relax for now. At, um, as, as at least one of them were normal. Uh, this is the normal, uh, this is the reward I was promising you. Nib nibicula cupcakes. Nib nibicula cupcakes? Hooray! I requested this as a test uh, as a test this time, but using potion to collect will be much more convenient. Um, there is a saying that witch's house, which applies the most potions every year, uses just as much. Tips for using potions can be found in the encyclopedia. If well fed, it will use a lot of uh, flowers. Oh, sorry. Again, thanks for your help. Have a nice day, Ellie. Well, you got flowers out of it. All right. Now, how do I use the broom again? Zoom zoom. It's all and broken, so I think I shouldn't be using it. Alright, so what we need to do, we need to talk to the... Oh, look at all this. I'm not cleaning all that up. 
Uh, oh, there she is. 8 to 6 p.m. Hello, time, uh, long, uh, hello, long time no see. <laughs> it hasn't been that long either. Is that so? Perhaps because I've been uh, while since I've been here. Did you remove them, uh, the prickly wines? Yes, it's nothing special. Is that so? You're humble. But you did real well. This village has been really gloomy for the past few years. I'm just getting started. That's a big start because the hope that uh, was gradually disappearing started to come back to life. So, never give up on this village. Okay, don't worry, I'll never give it, uh, give it up no matter what happens. You sound reliable. By the way, did you happen to bring the thing you promised last time? Of course. Are you talking about my uh, yak yakon, mel yakon melon? No. You promised a roaster handle to use for the roaster. I'm kidding, of course I brought it. Uh, but since um, this guy broke his leg, I don't think I can bring proper products for a while. Oh, really? I feel sorry for him. Thank you for your concern, but I don't worry. Um, it will be get better soon. The thing is on sale. Oh, the things on sale will be trivial things instead. Trivial things for instead. I have a good offer to, for each other. Um, I have a good offer for each other. Uh, do you want to hear it? Sure. What, what is it? As you can see, since this theory is not an uh, environment to bring good products, I'll make it better soon. Yeah, but I didn't mean it that way. However, um, there is a good witch here. And I want to use the witch of our uh, to our event to our advantage advent to our advantage. Is there such a witch here? That's what I'm saying. I can't see even. Um, I can can't see even up from here. I'm pretty confident with with my eyes uh, whether it might be a person or a thing. Swelly, I want to uh, to leave the work to you. What do you think? Naturally, you will also repeat, uh, re receive a proper wage, since you're good at uh, since good things deserve good prices. Really, for me? Really, for her? Oh, my nose. Yeah, I think um, I'll ask for a potion or animal or a plant gathering here. Now, does how does that sound? Of course, I like it. Naturally, I'll also look for the quality of product properly. Uh, that's because good things deserve good prices. Listen carefully, Ellie. Uh, it means a bad price for a bad product. Just like the the talking hat said. Therefore, uh, it's Virgil, a hat that deserves bad price. <laughs> a hat that des deserves a bad price. Keep up the good work, Ellie and Virgil. Okay, we'll work hard. Then um, I can talk talk about uh, work right away. Of course. Since I'm not a witch, I only sell the candies that uh, can be used for non-witches. Since I'm basically... Um... Achoo! Sniff sniff! <laughs> yeah, I know. It's not that, it's just... Um... When it gets so humid here uh, during the summer, my, my nose just start leaking for no reason. Um... Since I basically buy uh, them all the time, I can come and buy them... And, uh... Since I basically buy them and, uh, all the time, I can come buy them... See, I basically buy them all the time. I can come and buy them anytime. Okay, I had to read that three times to understand what you meant. I thought like since I thought it was um, the the wish I was talking. Since I basically buy them all the time, come and buy them anytime. Uh, and you do need a lot of potions from from time to time. Can you make a uh, ten healing candy just for in just one day? That's kind of hard. Isn't it? I have to talk to the person who buys it. If I need that many potions, I'll tell you one day in advance. In this case, it'll be able to buy it for more than... Exp for, uh, in this case, I'll be able to buy it for a uh, more expensive price than usual. Well, that's nice. Instead, you must deliver after making a promise. That's because trust is important. If you think you can, um, can't because of uh, other things, uh, you, you say you just can't. Okay. So can I ask you for one, one right away? Let's see here. Um, two healing candy by uh, cal uh, healing candy by tomorrow. I 
think I should be able to do that. Let's see, what do I need for it? It's 9 a.m. And healing candy, which is her maple extract. I have plenty of maple, and I need just a witch's thing then. It's here until 6. I think I could make one at least, right now. I need to double check how much I have. Um, put this away. These away. Two witches flower extracts. Um, maple herb extracts. How much do we have? Three. So we need to go out and get more maple. And I need how many of those? I need two. Six. I need five. I also need. Um, two maples my nose cries in the summer yes it does it's also the constant talking makes my nose rumble so it kind of it might be that too oh there's one so i need to know that in the in prior answer so i should make stuff and have them at hand right I need two more. Is there two more around? Or at least one more. Oh, there it is. And I need two of these. At least one, I think. Uh, no, that should be it. Yeah, that should be all I need, actually. She'll be here until 6 p.m., so I have plenty of time to make all the potions. And now the farming begins. Squish. Squish. Wish. Oh no, I need one more um, witch's thing. Witch's flower. Do we have enough laying around? It might not be any, any more around here until tomorrow. Oh, there's one. It's a cute running animation. I know, right? Just look at her wobble around. You can also make her walk slowly. And then she waddle away. Waddle, waddle, waddle. Hey, Double. We are doing good. Welcome to the cuteness stream. I uh, wanted a relaxing stream where I could just hang out and play something um, 
relaxing and I'm all I don't really want to play Stardew so they're playing this thing it's uh, currently available on the um, game pass on Xbox and uh, let's see here how was your stream you were streaming uh, Red Dead earlier today I think let's see here um, two witch flower extractors two maple herb um, set fire to stage four and sir right so it's us on four um, and stir right. And now we made a candy. Let's make another one. Wait, I didn't. I didn't need all that. I had all the ingredients to begin with. I only needed like one uh, witch's herb. All right, let's get to the witch and give her the candy. Uh, thank you for the welcome. A ducky said, so welcome is ducky here too. <laughs> uh, it was good getting further and finally figure out how to lower my bounty and progress the story. That's nice. Cause last time I watched you could barely walk into any town without getting shot. My, 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 as I said, my brother really wants me to play that. He loves that game. Um, and he really wants me to... I don't know why he wants me to play that. I think I'm actually getting to the point where I might consider it. Um, but for me, in my mind, I always remember the old first game. Which to me seems so boring. Because there's just a wasteland of orange with a few snakes around. But the second game is very pretty, very well made. Uh, so far it's great, my guy. It's a very big game as well. I remember seeing someone playing it um, a while ago when it came out. And they, found, they never completed it. And they had like... I think I've watched it for like a few weeks. Of them constantly playing it. There we go. There you go, candy. My first money. I think that's what uh, I like about uh, it. Um, you can do almost anything you want. Yeah, I was curious though, like, if you go on by the Law Binding Citizen Act, like, would you be able to, like, would you be able to, like, do the whole game without um, having to kill anyone? Or could you do it without getting a bounty? Could you just live your life as someone in the, the, the Wild West, right? So that, that's why something I wonder. Um, but I guess that will take away from you being the whole vigilante, cowboy, doing what you please kind of thing. The... Anyway. I ask you, I'll ask you again. Do you need anything? Um... Let's see what the shop has. Um, shop. We have 150. We can buy shit now. Pigeon Julius, epic hero John du uh, Don Julius, who defeated the demon lord, Alan Morgan. A love story with a girl named Jane, uh, who wished to spread her wings in the sky and fly as a blue pigeon, free from all. Sandra Martist. Um, a story who came uh, about, oh, a story came about from the shoe shiner Pietro. Who met a mischievous fairy. Um, life with mushrooms. Uh, common mushrooms are uh, for common mushrooms to rare mushrooms. Mushrooms for snacks. Mushrooms that can kill you one day. A uh, compendium of mushrooms. I think this is something I should be keeping. Oh, uh, I spent all my money. I can't buy the roster handle now. I should have bought the whole roster handle. Why didn't I? Let's see if we can sell anything. I don't have that kind of money. Uh, sell potions. I don't have any potions on me. Oh no. Um, I think 
all games uh, gives you a main story, but allows you to freedom to do other things, treasure hunt, hunt legendary animals, bounty hunter, etc. Uh, probably why you loved Elden Ring. I'm very much on the opposite side. I love being handheld through a game, but I do love to be able to do my own thing once in a while. I just don't like to stare too much away from away from the story. Let's see here. We we got the book. Shall I read a book? Life with mushrooms. The dark purple book cover is slightly soft and sturdy, but it says the author was uh, Mara Smith. Uh, where should I look? Mushrooms are everywhere. Single one is a not a single one is a bad mushroom. Unless you're a small child who takes anything interesting and put them into your mouth. <laughs> but such a passionate and pure inquiry process is uh, indispensable. We stand up up, um, upon the bodies of pure-hearted explorers. No need to join them. In that sense, this book uh, was not written only for my own effort, uh, but on to honor Sherry, the purest and most passionate explorer. I know this book. They recommended it to me at school. But why didn't you read it? Maybe Mara Smith who wrote this book. The kids say she died from eating poisonous mushrooms. <laughs> oh no. So I can't really trust it, can I? That's why I didn't read it. She was also a passionate and pure explorer. Where should I, um, where should I look this time? Rain cloud mushroom. The mushroom that looks like pure white cotton ball. It usually grows by sticking uh, to living trees. If it absorbs enough nutrient, nutrients, it will gradually turn black and spray water down like rain. After it rains like that, the color returns to pure white again. It's widely used in medicine because it helps digestion and pain killing effect. I guess I, I thought I could buy this and use this later. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. You have his bag. There's a crocodile. Hey, you're a witch? Yes, I'm Ellie, an apprentice witch. Hello. I'm Arden, a dragon and a cook. Do you need uh do you need help, brother? Uh, do you need help, rub uh, You're pretty kind. I don't mention oh uh, Did you help Rubrum? Not do you need help. Sorry, my bad. Um Are you staying here? I think I'll end up doing so. Uh why are you start staring at me like that? Oh, I'm sorry. It's my first time seeing a dragon with my own eyes. And <laughs> normally you wouldn't see one. Even mom said that she s seldom met a dragon. That's why uh, I wasn't sure, but uh, you're a real dragon. I never thought I would meet a chef dragon in a place like this. <laughs> Since dragons have no reason to mingle with humans. I think I was like that too. I can't tell you the reason even if you look at me with those eyes. Because I don't remember now. It's kind of weird to call uh, call it a reward, but tell me if you're hungry. Although it's usually not for free. Okay, sure. This is for helping Rubrum. Uh, take it since it's free. Well, I got uh, beef bread. Beef bread? Piping hot bread made by Arden. It's crunchy bread hold moist beef and vegetables inside. So it's like um, it's a pasty then. Like a pie. Thank you, I'll enjoy it. Um, it's the last one remaining. What's going on? Um, I have Arden's bag. I'm a dragon. Right. I also cook. I wouldn't have known if you didn't tell me. Then what more do you want to know? Well, why is a dragon working as a cook? Hmm, well... I forgot. <laughs> How could you forget that? I guess it wasn't so important. That doesn't seem so. Uh, how would you know even if I forgot? How would I know even if I forgot? Because you're a dragon, correct? And also cook. Well, of course. Hmm. What's the problem? <laughs> the problem is that you forgot. What's going on? <laughs> I, I, I wonder the same thing. I guess you're not too not busy. I also have some. I also have some work to do. 
I'm free, but um, no, I mean the restaurant. Are there no customers here? Well, because no one is, is here. I guess it's not delicious enough to bring in people from other villages. Uh, what's going on? Are you hungry? A beef stew. Ooh. I want to give him his bag though. Like I have Arden's bag right here. Oh, come back here, you lazy dragon. Oh, that's cool. He actually blows fire. I can't actually give it to him right now. What if I give the the book or the thing to her? Something powdery inside of the bag. Hello, E Knight. Hello, Ellie. Did you sleep well? I thought about it yesterday, but I'm still not sure. The villagers. Yeah. You mean they would want to come back, right? I don't know why you're more confident than me when I come when I lived here for my whole life in this village. Even so I decided to believe in that happy thought. Really? Hi fishy. Right, that's it. Picks up witch. Gonna drown the witch in the end of the game. <gasps> do not drown the witch. I'm doing good. This this is a cute witch. You do not drown her, you, you give her cupcakes. You give you give you give her cupcakes right now. <laughs> Don't be rude. Give her cupcakes. <laughs> Just look at that smile of hers. You can't you can't drown that. <laughs> if you get rid of the prickly wines, I'll try to contact the resident who was living in that house. But if that res resident refuses, don't worry because it won't happen. Ellie, you're so nice. Everything will be fine. Do not worry. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. So, uh, who should we get first? Was there a, car a carpenter in this village by any chance? Because I think the first thing we need is a carpenter in order to fix the house. Of course. The house in the upper left, uh, from left side from the central fountain of the village belongs to Kyla, who was a carpenter. Um... It would be better to remove the prickly vines from Kyle's house first. That would be better if you could get rid of the prickly vines. I'll try to contact uh, Kyla. It's complicated witch. <laughs> made, made it of other witches. No! Don't do that. This is cute witch. This is a cute witch in the forest. The cute witch in the forest deserve only the bestest, cutest cupcakes. No witchy cupcakes. Only cutest, bestest cupcakes. Leave it to me. Okay, I'll leave it to you. Uh, you're doing me a favor. The premise of the game was she was riding the train to go to become an apprentice in High Lion Big City for witches. But the train stopped because there was some prickly wines in the way. And um, Ellie ended up going around in the forest and got stuck. Uh, she didn't get stuck, she ended up uh, exploring and then fell asleep and woke up too late because the train was fixed and it could leave um, and the train only left behind without her. So, she, so she's stuck in a, uh, an old witch's house with no witch being an apprentice that just stays there and more or less uses her witch's power to make potions and stuff to help the villages, to restore the village I guess. You can have the hat, but the hat talks, you know. The hat is actually a living creature. You have to be friends with them first. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. You, you literally restore the village and open up more paths in the forest that's stuck right now by making potions, by gathering um, ingredients. It's, it's a cute game. It's like... Um, it's like if Stardew Valley, uh, Stardew Valley was a story game, I guess. And it's, 
if Stardew, uh, Stardew Valley was also cute with witches and uh, little monsters that wouldn't attack you. Because so far we haven't met a single um, harmful enemy. Alright, let's get this thing started. Keep in mind that you don't have information, nor do you have a phoenix. The first thing I do is collect information. Let's look around Kyla's house and once I collect information. Let's think about the phoenix later. Would that be okay? Well, I guess if I could buy something from um, the, the lady, maybe. This must be a house of the person named Kyla. You really want the hat now? It's a sarcastic being. <laughs> Apparently, uh, it belonged to Ellie's mother. Because it, it keeps making references of how reckless Ellie is. And it, it, she's just like her mother. In the same condition as the other houses. If you don't get rid of the prickly vines, there's no point of rebuilding the house. Now that we have uh, the location, let's ask the other villagers. Right, let's, um, we need to get rid of the prickly vines at some point. Talk about... Um, Welcome, the sun feels nice again today. Do you have something? Uh, yeah, we have the prickly wine. Uh, when it first appeared, I tried very hard to get rid of it. I tried an axe and also set it on fire, but it was useless. No matter how I made the scar, it healed quickly. Uh, that resembled the white prickly wine. Isn't that right? Uh, but the uh, white prickly wine disappeared completely when there was a full moon. And these wine doesn't disappear even when there was a full moon. It's as strong as a white prickly wine, but doesn't disappear in the moonlight. That's strange. Uh, we thought so too. I mean, it's the uh, providence of nature that if there is a strong, if there are strong places, there are also uh, weak places. This is all I know. I'm sorry I couldn't be of hel much help. No, it's okay. Uh, it was helpful enough. Let's see if we can talk to... Is Rebram around? You can see the vines actually starting to gather up their houses as well. So this is the grandma's place. It's a... Um... Where's Rebram? Rebram! Or else it's this place. I don't want to spend too much time like picking up um, time and energy picking up vines, but um, it could be something to do. I uh, wonder if he remembers anything. Yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah. But will you be able to do it? Of course. I'll bring the village back to its former appearance. That's some confidence. Okay. What's going on? The prickly ones of the village? Yes, and uh, just in case you know something. Well, I don't know much about the prickly vine. I just feel uh, the malice filled in it. The malice? The prickly vine that only destroys houses. It's so unnatural. Um, if it's not someone's malice, what would it be? Is there someone who would do such a terrible thing? I don't know. Well, heh. I'm not sure, but I don't know anything. How about searching the tr uh, throughout the witch's house, at least? Okay, sure. Oh, and uh, on the way uh, to the witch's house, please do me a favor. What? What kind? I lost a bag containing an important ingredient. I think it was uh, lost somewhere near the water. Please try and find it. I remember carrying it into the village. Well, we've already found that before, I guess. We, ha we have it already. Uh, oh, I picked up a, a bag next to the river. Is uh, this the one by any chance? Oh, that's that's the one. And we got more beef bread. I was looking for it. Good. Here, take this. What's going on? Actually, now that we have so much um, food we can eat, we could potentially use that to... Um, while we are picking up all this prickly wine, herbs and stuff. Let's 
it's gonna take a while. So how have you been doing? Doing great. You been playing any fun games lately? Watching any fun TV shows? I have, on the other hand, has finally arrived at uh, a decent episode of um, 230 of One Piece. It's uh, it's been a long journey, and it's a uh, it's a longer one still. You watched the latest Batman movie. What do you think of it? I haven't watched it myself. I recently did go through and watch all the old ones. Um, not the not the Tim Burton ones, but the, um, the 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 Dark Knight series. Right, let's eat one of these. Oh, it doesn't really give me that much, does it? Oh, it doesn't really fill up. Oh, it doesn't fill up all the way because I'm tired. It was so freaking good. Um, I was going into it like meh because of, uh, I guess I, I kind of know why. Um, but it was apparently very good. It's better than the Dark Knight series. Well, that's good. At least it's better than the Ben Affleck version, I guess. It's going to take a while. It would be nice if I didn't actually click on that all the time. Alright. I'm going to give that up for today. Let's uh, hurry up home and have a sleep. We should have actually collected stuff to make more... Uh, Make some more potions. Because I kind of need that uh, rotor, don't I? Anything is better than the Affleck versions. <laughs> I don't know. Rubber Nipple Batman is not really the best thing if you rewatch them. I remember loving the, the Tim Burton versions, but um, it's not the same anymore. Let's fix the broom. You know how to fix brooms? Of course, broom maintenance is a standard course at the school. I remember the broom you were working on. It flew as it spewed water from behind. I wanted to spit fire, but it wasn't water. Uh, it wasn't water to cool too. You're lucky it was summer and that uh, it wasn't on fire. Listen, I take the rubber nipple over the Ben Affleck moody shin. <laughs> I am sad, man. I am the Batman. No one would have laughed if it was uh, wasn't one of those two. Um, well, it was just once. I can fix it if I have the required materials. Branch and mud, or, mud, or branch or mud, can be easily found in the forest. I have quite a few branches. This can be put in the bookshelves upstairs. And we needed... Branches. Where's Martha? How do you know that name? I feel like that part was literally someone who read the comic and realized, you know they have the same mother? Isn't that weird? Let's put that in the movie and make it cringy. Alright. Had some more dreams, it seems like. Very strange. 
What nonsense is it? Um, is this after a good night's sleep? I had a strange dream. What kind of a dream? Uh, I don't remember. And oh, actually, let's uh do this. Hello, Ellie. This is Diana from Brings Happiness. Let's see what the shop has. Um, upgrade my workshop or oh, your work tool. Bigger quantities of ingredients or potions at once. Ooh, you can make multiple potions. You can upgrade uh, processing tools and extractor and rusters. Which potions? I don't have the money. Potion sale. I don't have anything. The witch's catalog uh, only carries items with the witch's association. A cupcake. I have six. Let's see. Um, I don't. I can't. Afford, I can afford a bug net. I need a bug net. Hell yeah. Let's see. Um, bug net. I can do this now. Now I can catch the. Um, see, uh, we have a bush around here somewhere. Oh, anyway, uh, I'm gonna talk to the, the lady over here real quick and see uh, what we need for today. What kind of potions we need? Because I need that uh, rotor. I could talk about this. I don't have any information on that. Do you need anything? Yes, I need a uh, shop. Actually, no. Um, this, there we go. Let's see here. I uh, need two. What? Sorry, what's this? Curious lifting candies. Let's see what we actually need for that. I don't think we have made a curse lifting candy before. Two squishy furs and two... Um... Oh, we don't really need too much of it. Uh, let's see here. We need two of them, so we need uh, to get some squishy furs. Vim vim. Vim vim. There you go. I think I have all the stuff I need to make this anyway. I might need some more fur though. Oh, I do need one more fur, I see. Um, but I have all of these I need. Let's go and squish some fur balls. Like, the, the cutest thing to how to get ingredients in this game is that you don't actually attack or kill monsters. You give them hugs or play with them to get it. And then we squish him. And now we get uh, the squishy fur. We squish him. Oh. Squishy bug. A bush bug. We got our first bush bug. I wonder if you use that for something. We can actually catch the, the, the moon butterflies too. See if we can use that for something. Let's see. Uh, activate. We need squishy fur extract. 
squish. Um, how do we make this? Let's see. Fire to tree, don't stir. Two squishy fur and maple. Uh, we need to put this here. And craft. That's one. And put this a tree. Don't stir. There we go. Curse lifting candy. Let's uh, go back and deliver these. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of the stuff I don't need in my inventory first. And then we're gonna have plenty of money. And now we can buy that uh, thing we needed. And after we've done that, I think we should potentially just... Uh, like this thing, for example. How you get extract from this is that you, you start petting him. And he start running away. You run after him, you start tickling him again. And after you tickle him enough times, he will drop something. It's adorable. Oh, there's Rubrum. The wind feels good. Any interesting stories? The prickly one is not so good. Um, not so good. It's bitter, spicy, and not tasty. It also smells fishy. You ate it? Yes, <laughs> I drank it by uh, draw, uh, drawing it as drawing it as a tea. I dried and roasted it, but uh, picking only thorns, and it was hard. I guess you're drinking everything. <laughs> everything is a tea. There are so many delicious tea ingredients uh, in the forest. I like apple bush because they, it's sweet. Grandma said the bird tea smells good. Bird flower tree smells good. But also make delicious tea for you, Ellie. Okay, I'll look forward to it. Oh, I remembered. I tasted a similar that of to that. It tasted similar to that thing. It also tasted similar to the white prickly wine, like and little honey pumpkin in the forest. I think you also tried drinking all of them. I guess you tried drinking all of them. Um, it's a bad take for you. So, um, is this like a relaunch of that new series, by the way, Ducky? Is that like a, oh, this is the whole Batman as uh, a kid again? Or is it like Batman established? Or is it Batman in his early prime where he, he is still learning to become Batman? White prickly wine uh, was a good scent. Hmm, if it tastes similar, um, can you see it as a similar breed? So something to do with the honey, honey, uh, the honey flower and the prickly white. Hmm. Established. That's cool. That's cool. I know a lot of people hate it. Like I felt the same thing with Spider-Man. That we had enough retelling of his story. That we, I just want to see him established. Like here's proper Spider-Man living his life at uh, the ed like the 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 main big time of his life kind of thing. Hmm. It tastes similar, but uh, can you see it as a similar breed? Thanks anyway. It was helpful. All right, come over for uh, for tea sometime. All right. I think I asked everyone. To summarize what you've heard so far, E Knight said it was a similar characteristic as a wick white prickly wine. Reverend said it tastes like little honey pumpkin. It's probably also similar to little uh, the little honey pumpkin. Arden didn't tell me anything in particular. He said it was someone's malice. Um, seeing a prickly wine that can destroy and get rid of a house is enough to make you think so. It seems like Arden thinks it's a, a witch's work. Witch's curse. Uh, in a world like today, that's old-fashioned way of thinking. I feel you. <laughs> I suppose, yeah. Also, the music in this game is very pretty. I just realized. Although the Tom Holland Spider-Man was fun. To me, Tom Holland series is kind of meh. It's good that they're restarting it. I just don't like him. Like, I liked him when he was... It was him having to figure out everything instead of... I am... Uh, Tony Stark's poster boy and Forgotten Child and now everything I have is made by Tony Stark that I didn't like I, I want him to be okay I'm the researcher studying like you know the, the Spider-Man video games on PlayStation that's exactly the time 
I want him to be, where he's studying to become better. He has, he's been underneath um, to Dr. Croc and Dr. Octavius for a while. Um, and he's now trying to start his own thing together with his, his friend, um, which was the Green Goblin's son or something. I kind of want that establishedness. Which kind of makes me want to play the new Spider-Man, or oh, the, the old and the new Spider-Man game on PlayStation. Maybe. Which is curious. In a world like today, it's an old-fashioned way of thinking. You wouldn't think so if you, um, you've been to Lo uh, Lo Lucerine or two. But the wishes of the old days are still alive. Heh. Let's find the culprit later. Let's think about Kyla's house first for now. Let's also go look for the witch's house uh, through the witch's house, like Arden said. I think I might have seen something related to the prickly wine in the witch's bookshelf on the first floor. It would be so fun seeing, silly man. Have you not seen the game yet? Or seen someone play it? Let's see here. Um, I want to go back to you and give you the candy. Welcome. I got candy. Candy. And let's buy that rotter now. Bam bam. We still have like 130 left. We could potentially buy the books. I don't really see any other reduces for what I have currently. I should probably save it so I can update my stuff, right? Or expand the bag. Expanding the bag could definitely be something that uh, I need to do soon. Because there's not a lot of space left, is it? So much to do there. I also really want to go back and have a look at the um, and have a. Oh, actually, I, it's, um, do you want anything today? This is a special delivery postal service for the witch's catalog. Today's delivery um, has been updated. Please check the delivery list and make a selection. I can make more candy and. Uh, get uh, 36 Luna coin no I don't want I don't want to do it right now I can do that later um, let's update this first because this has been broken let's fix this I think this will do something for me good work you'll be able to make more potions Oh, I have some stuff for that. Let's, uh, let's see what we can put in. We have some of the fur. Let's see, let's uh, make the extract first. It's 12 p.m. I need four for that. I should go to sleep. Is it that late already? No. Can't be. It was daytime. Oh, it's, oh, it's, oh, it's noon. That's my bad. Well, I'm here. Book related to prickly wine. And... I can't read anymore. I can't finish reading this here. Why not finishing reading it? Finish reading it. I would get rid of the prickly wine. Who would get rid of? Um, who would get rid of the prickly wine if I die? People don't just die because they're reading book uh, for a long time. Hmm, I mean, Arya's daughter might die. <laughs> Look at this book. It looks like there's more than a thousand pages. Anyone would die after reading this. Then you're not going to read anymore. I think I'll throw up if I read more uh, text. I think the important detail comes out right after that. What? Really? Where? 
The first dew of the spring, the red moon, butterfly, the fourth dawn of summer. Summarize if you're not um, going to make it. Mix well and pull, put the desired plant uh, seeds to make a new plant. It's a method to combine the plant's char char characteristic. Uh, the prickly ones in the village over here combine using this method. It seems so. From the information I heard, it seemed to be a combination of little honey pumpkin and white prickly wine. Uh, then now. Wait, why is this book here? Someone's malice? Mm, but... Uh, naturally, the book is not uncommon. It's a book that any witch uh, who is interested in plants would have. Correct. It, it's a mere, merely a possibility that both of them, I mean both of them, for now this one is has priority. Which one? The part that removes the prickly wines. Let's look throughout the Kyla's house again. I'll, I'll do that later. It says something about the, the, the first dawn and it's... Don't really seem like that kind of thing, is it? Anyway, let's get one of these first. Thank you. Let's see, I kind of want to oh, catch some more bugs. It also means that I need to catch some of those butterflies, isn't it? Oh yeah, there were some butterflies up here, wasn't it? But that's probably not during daytime. Also get some more of these while we're here. Because these will come in handy. Okay, so there's no butterflies here right now because it's daytime. And they don't like light. The other question is, what happened to all the spiders? And what happened to this thing? Um, this is locked. We need to find like a potion that grows stuff for doing that. Ooh, piece of rock. Ooh, piece of rock. Oh, we need chalk to do that. So we don't have spiders. We just need chalk. I guess at some point we'll know how to make chalk. There's no other way or places to go right now, I think. I have to wait until night time so I can catch more of the, the butterflies. Also good to get these while we're here. The rest of the place seems uh, not abandoned but hard to get to because we were stuck. Need to get the one another way through.
We're starting at night time now, so that's good. Uh, while we're here, let's... We haven't done that in a while, so let's um, go down to the, the train station. I don't have enough stamina. Oh no. I don't have any stamina thing to, to, to wake me up with. And we can still go over and have a look. And see if you can actually see anything here. I cannot run currently. I could take a nap. Yeah, there's nothing over here anymore. I think you can take a nap here. I think we need to go back to the, the house to have a nap so we can actually catch some of those butterflies. Here we go, butterfly time. Thump. I want to see if there's anything actually over here during night time, because we haven't been here during night time. No, no spider. No, it doesn't seem like there's any spiders hanging around. Don't run away from me. Here we go, blue, uh, blue butterfly. Can't catch that. Maple herb, we always need a maple herb. I know there's two here. Actually, we should, um, should pick one of these while we're here. Oh, no. We can't collect more, can we? I don't have stamina. No, I was so close. At least I got one of them. Oof. Oh well, I guess it's uh, time for night night then. Check the state of Kyla's house again. Uh, sure. Later. What do we use the uh, dried fur for? Um. Try removing all the vines around if it's, if you're curious about its true appearance. You could splash like a vine removal thingy on it, I guess. Actually, that's a. Uh Spend the night doing this. If I have any, if I'm not using energy to do it.
This is something that will take time, I think. Oh, it takes actual take time. It actually takes time. Let's uh, sort this one out. Oh. Creating a lot of like fur and stuff here now. We can actually use these. Squish. At least we'll have these for the future. I think to get more potions, we need to buy potion recipes from the the lady outside, maybe. Bird flower. Oh, we can make one of these as well. So as we get them, we can uh, and sort them out, I guess. running out of space. I don't know what you can put in here though. I don't know what kind of uh, inventory this is. Um, this, yes. I am going to make it the sleep and uh, doing the, the savings. And I think that's going to be where we are ending for today because um, it's getting late and it's getting warm in here. Can I do anything here? So doing a save. There we go. Alright, that, that's where you save and load. Anyway, um, let's see here. Um, there we go. Fuck you! Fuck you, fuck you! <laughs> fuck you! Ah, that's a, that's a very terrible timing. We were just ending off for today. Welcome in, welcome in, everybody. We were playing um, Little Witch in the Wood. Look at this cute little game. Look at this cute little game. We are playing a... Uh, Relaxation, um, relaxation, restoration, and potion gathering maniac little girl making potions as an apprentice witch. It's adorable. Uh, but that's not what we're going to play next time. We're going to play a new game tomorrow. I think we're going to continue playing Guns of Icarus for one more time with the gang. If they will want to play it another time, that's the question. Or we will figure out a new game to be playing. You saw what I was playing and it looked interesting. It's, it's free on... Um, Xbox Game Pass, if you want to pick it up. If I also think it's about 13... I think it's 13 pound 20 something. I think that's what someone saw, what it was. It's uh, it's like Stardew Valley, but adorable. Even more adorable. And I don't think you have anything that will hurt or harm you. Uh, but anyway, um, that will be it for me today. Um, it's getting warm and warmer in here, so I'm going to have a, re a relaxing little time, have an ice cream and uh, watch some YouTube or whatever. I haven't haven't actually catched up on watching YouTube in so long. It's not just warm, it's my room is ter terrible with this anyway. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have an ice cream. I'm going to probably switch out my warm Pepsi with something actually cold. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. Uh, we'll be playing this again next Wednesday, definitely, because I'm loving it. It's 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 a bree like new new breeze, you can say, because um, I've been wanting to play Stardew uh, properly for so long. But I I did complete Stardew once upon a time, and now I'm just bored of it. I want something new that kind of like piques my interest, because it's it's new things happening. So I think this will definitely do it. It's super cute, and yeah. Uh, but then again, is anyone online right now?
Uh, yeah, Cyber is online. I'm going to send you guys over to Cyber. Uh, I think he's still trying to reach his affiliate. So I'll catch you guys there. And remember to say hi to him and give him a follow and give him your love. I'll catch you guys later. Bye bye for now. And see you when I see you. Bye. <laughs> Nobody's gonna expect me in here. <laughs> Nobody's gonna expect me in here. <laughs> what the crap? I saw you run in there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k k I'm not talking to you. Be like that. Guess we have to press it, right? No, I'm gonna press it. I don't need you. That was disappointing. Call me a loose free shit. Yeah. Why don't you try it? See? Puppet I can't do shit. Doody do, I'm a puppet. Bonk bonk bonk. Only you can press a button wrong, host. Really hammer it. I don't wanna. Whatever, I guess it doesn't work. Like stuff that doesn't need to do shit.